Hey there, Wargamers, and welcome to our Horus Heresy Battle Report today. Luca here from MiniWargaming.com, joined by my guest, Adam. And we are bringing you a simple 2,000 point, nothing too heavy handed, Horus Heresy Battle Report today. It will be the Word Bears going up against some Renegade Salamanders, or Traitorous, however you want to look at it. We play and call it work. Mini Wargaming's Horus. Heresy. Let's take a look at our word bearers today. I'll be playing traitors naturally. It'd be interesting to play them as loyalists one day, maybe. But for now, I'll be playing the Dark Brethren Red of War. And that means we got a Praetor as our warlord. Uh, we are going to give him unswerving devotion, which mostly allows us to do two shooting phase reactions. But it's got an okay effect of automatically passing the first morale check. Uh, for a unit within six of him, including his own unit, if it comes up. Uh, he is going to be equipped with Burning Lore, which will be a mandatory upgrade for him. It'll give him the Psyker type uh, and give him access to Diabolism, uh, but it mostly gives him the Corrupted type so he can join the Galvor back in this list. We're going to Mastercraft his Paragon Blade, and we upgraded his Plasma Pistol to be a Warfire Pistol. Pew pew! That's the sound it makes, if anyone was curious. The other HQ choices will be a Chaplain because it's very good to use in general. And the word bearers of old always have to bring a chaplain along with them. Uh, we're gonna Mastercraft his Power Maul, and uh, he is gonna be corrupted. So we dark channeled his butt, so he has an extra 25 points, but it allowed him to also join the Galvor back. Always, everyone in the unit has to be corrupted. That's why I'm doing this. And then we're having something new and fun in this list that I have recently got a little bit ago. It is a Moritat upgrade. I am going to be giving him two Warpfire pistols and we're going to dark channel his butt too to make him corrupted. Moving on to our elite choices, this is where it kind of ties in the Moritat. I have an Ashen Circle unit of five that I corrupted with dark channeling as well so they can all run around together. They're all bitter duty so they can become a unit. So they're like uh, the word bearer destroyer unit equivalent. Uh, no other upgrades on them, but I will be running a second Ashen Circle squad uh, without the dark channeling because if, if I'm going to run one, I might as well see what two can do for me here. Uh, I will be running six Dark Brethren, or sorry, the Gal Vorvac Dark Brethren. One of them is going to have a power fist and uh, one single apothecary as well who will be joining one of my troop options, a tactical support squad, which will be riding in a rhino with Dozer Blades and Searchlights. And uh, we're going 10 strong here. One of them is gonna have an Augury Scanner just to help with, uh, in case I needed it, but I don't think I will in this game. And uh, they're all Warpfire Blasters. Guys, this is a 150 point upgrade. So let's see if it does anything for them. The rest of my troops will be three bare bone squads of tacticals, uh, which isn't a bad choice for the word bears because they're all stubborn six, effectively. Uh, so just kind of spamming cheap small squads can have some effect in uh, gumming up units. Our last option in our 2000 point list will be a heavy support squad. The sergeant will have artificer armor and they're all equipped with las cannons. One of them will have an augury scanner though. And that is it. Let's go take a look at our traitorous salamanders today. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Adam. I'm joining you from the wonders and wilds of the land down under. And I'm here to play some traitor salamanders. I have uh, defined myself as the guy who takes the loyalist legion and plays them as the traitors. Playing traitor dark angel as, as well as my main. But I'm here to play some traitor sallies because I like the sounds of that. They're probably not traitors. They're probably just disenchanted, disenfranchised members of the salamanders who decided to go their own way. And I start off with a... Rite of War, I've got a Delegatus as my Centurion, so it allows me to take a Rite of War, which is the Covenant of Flame, which allows my Pyro class, which I've got two of, to be line in addition to a Tactical Squad and a Tactical Support Squad. The two Pyro class squads, which are five mans with um, a Power Axe on the Sergeant, both have Rhinos with Doja Blaze and Searchlights and a Super Flamer upgrade for the Pintle. In addition, that is the same for my Tactical Support Squad, which is of Melter Guns, a nine man, also with a same Rhino. I should tell you about my Centurion though, who has taken the Redemption of Flame Traitor Warlord Trait, which allows him to give plus one to wound and plus one armor penetration to any squad that is of Flame, or Melter, or Volkite that he joins. Um, he's got a, I, I can't remember, I think it's a Mastercrafted Power Axe and a Volkite Charger. And then we have five Fire Drake Tomies, Thunder Hammers, and Storm Shields, of course, or Dragon Scale Storm Shields. We have a single tactical squad, if I did not list that before. Jumping down to the heavy supports, we have a Derek Dayo with the auto cannons, the Aeolus missile launcher, and a twin heavy bolter in the front. A heavy support squad backs that up as a 10 man with Volkite culverins, and you can see where I'm going with this. This is where my Delegatus is gonna hang out and give them plus one to wound. They're gonna be able to do a lot of heavy lifting. We then have rounding things out a single Sakara Venator with heavy bolters all round, and that ties off my 1,999 points of 
salamanders. Today, Adam and I will be playing Blood Feud. We just rolled it up, and it's a perfect scenario for what we're trying to do today. And uh, we've got a hammer and anvil style deployment. So, with Blood Feud, we are going to go ahead and deploy all of our forces a, along the short table edge here, 24 inches apart from one another. And the goal is to absolutely just bonk each other off the table, just destroy each other completely. But we're going to be secretly noting down a target we're really trying to actively go for, because we're only really going to get victory points if we go for the proper target. So the goal is to kind of like try and fake out what you're going for and get as many points as you can in the real target while trying to guess what your opponent is trying to go for and save face in that regard where you can, when you can. And then the different categories were different amounts of points, infantry being one of the lower points but the easiest to acquire, Primark being up to six victory points. Uh, and then the secondaries are going to be Last Man Standing and of course Slay the Warlord. And Price of Failure will not matter on this one. Shout out to Westgate Wargaming Club. Go check it out Wednesday nights at the lovely Two Birds Brewery. If you're ever in Melbourne and want to play some heresy throwdown, might see me there too. And that's uh, all the way over in Australia. <laughs> yeah, it's just a little, just, just a hop, skip, jump from here. <laughs> just Pretty a short. little bit of one. 20 each hours away <laughs> by flight. <laughs> if you fight well. As the crow flies. <laughs> Beautiful. Here is a closer look at our table for today's game here. Adam and I are going to roll off to see who gets to pick what side and do what they want with that side of the battlefield, right? So uh, that's pretty much it. Whoever rolls this win uh, wins this roll off will deploy first and go first. If you so choose, you could let me go first and go first if you wanted to. So, but I want to pick the board side. Ah, uh, that's... I, naturally, I want the board side with the Salamander's piece on it, so I'm going to go here. That's first. And um, you get to go first, too. Do I, do I have to? Can I, can I just pick that side and make you deploy first? You can't. Okay. All right, well, <laughs> pick, pick it side, but we're going. But you get to go first. That's the nice thing about yeah, it. Yeah, nice. All right. And here we are, all deployed, folks. I deployed second, but I'll go over what I got here. I got my Ashen Circle. These are the corrupted ones, so they're painted red with the Mortad, who's also corrupted. Tacticals, the other Ashen Circle who are not corrupted. They got the old style scheme going for them. We got a Rhino with our Plasma Support Squad in there. I would love to deal with the Volkite Squad across the table, but that's terrifying. I'm just going to try to mitigate. These guys can eat it. These are my Tacticals can eat the Volkite. We got Tacticals, Tacticals. The Gabor back with the characters, Chaplain and Praetor. Our Warlord is over here. Our Laz Cannon team in the back, kind of doing the same thing as the, um, yeah. uh, the Volkite on the other side. So what do you got over here, Adam? All right, well, starting at the back, I've got my Delegatus with my Volkite squad sitting up on the raised position. We've got my Venator hanging out here. We realized uh, in my previous game, it's only 36 inch range. I usually try and put him like, I, it, inherently I'd be like, oh, you chuck him at the back. Like and artillery, like, yeah. No, he won't do anything. Uh, two into pyro class, uh, the five mans uh, in their associated rhinos, all got those of blades. 10 tacticals just hanging out here on the line. We have my my beautiful Cestus, which has landed to disgorge its uh, fire drakes right on the line. I think that uh, looks pretty spiffy, looks pretty cool. And this, this lined up nicely too, because the, the way the board was set yeah. up, we just set it all up and then we got hammer and anvil, so that, that worked out perfectly. Um, Dero Dero hanging out here, and then uh, we have the Melter Squad over on the other flank. Absolutely, and then we're busting out the old battle boards for this game here, just to get, because they have a lot of character built into them. And we wanted to, uh, I forgot to mention earlier, but we wanted to give them a little bit more uh, nuances. So the lava fields, the little rivers of lava here, will count as dangerous and difficult terrain, unless you're going over a bridge or something. We right? did have a bit of an argument that maybe the, the Salamander <laughs> should, should know better by now, and just be like, ah, it's fire, it's fine. I'm sure they'll be fine. But no, 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 DT for us too. That dangerous terrain, everything should be good. They've they've got dozer blades. They've done the song and dance. You're gonna watch this live. Yeah, they're, they're gonna, not gonna fail this. They're gonna surf the lava to victory. No Let's problem call, whatsoever. Call right now. I on the other hand, I'm gonna avoid it like the lava. It is. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna take every path I can not over the lava because dangerous terrain is real scary in this game, guys. Uh, otherwise, uh, we're we're pretty good to go here. I will be going second. Turn one for the salamanders. I'm not gonna bother seizing because that is degenerate maneuvers. I do not appreciate seizing the initiative. Just play the freaking game. Let the guy who deploys first goes first. Play the game. How many? Let me tell you how many times the seize the initiative makes the game not a good game. Pretty much every, every time. time. <laughs> Pretty much every time. So take that into consideration. Turn one, Sally's. Good luck, Adam, but better luck to me. Good luck, man. <laughs> gonna, pretty much all these rhinos are going to have to take DTs. So I'm going to do them all at the same time. Here's the melter one. He's good. He's good. The uh, first pyro class. He's, uh, uh, you got a reroll, though. A uh, reroll. Boop, boop, boop. Oh! oh okay. The I, ap I apologize. The I got stuck off the rip. <laughs> uh, and then the other one. It's good. 
You got five. a five, yeah, you got so, a five. So, uh, that one's staying there, right? Okay, and then we're gonna show you where the rest of everything else moves. It wasn't even lava. Okay, to give him credit, it wasn't lava. It wasn't lava, <laughs> it was a pipe. It was Pipe's not to be trusted, lava's fine though. That's completely out of the equation. <laughs> That's it, movement done. So the rhinos that passed their dangerous range track zipped <laughs> forward. Forgot to show it off on camera. It was gonna be one of the rhinos I was gonna go for, for the Dark Brother and things, so I just randomized it. I was That's the target. I have to do some damage to that or kill it to trigger the Dark Brother in. I'll explain what that means further on. I just get stats, I get favor of the Dark Gods. They're happy with my accomplishments. We got Fire Drakes in the middle. The Daredale pokes up and around the corner. The Volkite naturally stays still. And the, did the Venator move at all? The Venator just shifted over. Oh, okay. It's gonna it's line up shots on the Galvabrak. It can't see the the well, it can't get in range of the Rhino uh, right. from here, so Galvabrak it is. Uh, the other thing to notice is they disembarked him. We'll yeah, it with the getting mobilized, I just disembarked and advanced him and just ran him up. Um, they did not advance though, they can't anyway, and that one just moved. So uh, we've got searchlights on all three of my rhinos, and they're gonna pick three different units essentially to light up. Um, this one's going to line up the Galvabrac, so the Venator gets to shoot at it. This one's going to go for the Tax Squad, which is going to enable the Volkites. And this one's going to go for the Rhino, which is going to enable the, um, the Derrideo. Yes, I'm just mentioning all that because we have uh, Night Fighting in effect here. Correct. Absolutely. Uh, so you can see me back, but I think my shooting's a little bit better than yours. And if, you, if, if you're going to pop rhinos, well, you're going to pop exactly. rhinos. Probably going to pop rhinos anyway. That's pretty much not it. Much yeah, exactly. gonna, not much I'm going to save him. Where um, would you... Oh, I guess you get, you get to at least shoot those rhinos first. Uh, Oh, that's true. They got, the couple lights, of, yeah. they got yeah. a couple they of bolters. Yeah, yeah. Huzzah. Rhino first. So this rhino is just going to shoot for. Uh, Ash Are they got two up armors? The Ashen Circle. The they have a character with a two up armor saving there. Yeah, I'll just go for that with okay. the, a, a combi bolter, which is not in rapid fire range. Which hit. Is a hit. And uh, I'll uh, reroll that one. We're going to have a dedicated the, rolling spot. I know it's going to have to be uh, somewhere in the back there. Yeah, it's a wound, yeah, and then rooms. I'll do a three up. Okay. Bra brave of you. <laughs> Very brave of you, my man. I think they're too easy. Find the only one would rip. All right, I'll, I'll, maybe two ups in the future. Over here, Derrida is going to go everything into the Rhino. Oh, the Rhino back there, gotcha. Yep. yep so we've got uh, four shots with the auto cannons hitting on twos, re rolling. Um, and then it is strength seven Sunder. So it, it would be three stick as a negative one to hit. Of course, fighting. so the yep. two missed. Re roll. Re roll. Uh, <laughs> it's good. Yep, That's good. the problem with the board. Um, yeah. So force to, force to glance, five to pens, and I get to re roll because I got Sunder. So we've got two pens. Uh oh. Oh, Four nice. Pens. Uh, well, he's gonna have just various little six-up saves. My uh, poor rhino sixes. Nothing. They're all dead. So he can't be destroyed. But I gotta do. Uh, see if the guys inside are shaking from the penetrating hits. They are. Oh, you just pinned my plasma squad. And now, well, they're uh, they're they have to snap fire. Are they actually pinned? They are. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Eleven and right. twelve. So they're gonna know. they're just gonna all be around there. They're sh they're pinned and yeah, that's rough. That's bad. This is straight up bad, guys. So we have to uh, disembark uh, pretty close around the hatches there. I do have to do five danger train uh, six danger train checks. This is just a, a horrible chain of events that just keeps continuing. The Vexilla. Okay, he's dead. Oh my uh, god. Uh, and you can't use damage. Only involves no damage mitigation. So then I have five other re regular dudes. The sergeant was where the heck was the sergeant? Oh, he's right there too. Sergeant is a uh, stupid die. Sergeant is alive, and then I have four other random guys that I don't care about. One more dice. I'll just say this guy. Oh, oh, yeah. Then we're on to the continue the shooting. Volkites are going to go for that tactical that tactical one over there. Absolutely. I've got thirty of the fifty Woo. shots here. Uh, we're going to hit on threes. It would be fours because knife fighting. Fours for knife fighting. Yep. They're, they're led up by the rhino. We didn't do the rhino shots earlier, but like we don't really need to. That's fine. Yeah, I think this is this will be enough to take him out. Now I've got another twenty, which will be the full fifty complement. All right. This will be twos to wound. Twos to wound, guys. No relevant AP here, just no, my no, power no. armor. You just take it as take it as you 20 wounding hits on them. The only guy that can't die is the one in the middle, because he should be safe. But uh, he's not the sergeant, so. <laughs> These are all threes. And then every fail is uh, deflagration. Fails? That's 10 fails. Oh, nine fails? Hey, you know what? Deflag won't matter. This one guy can't. Uh, you know what? I wonder if deflag breaks the line of sight rule. Yeah, I've got no idea how that works. We might have to, we might have to ask, trust a, trust a friend on that one. You know I'll what? Roll it. Yeah. And we'll find out. So this is the deflag for the nine fails, which is nine more saves. He's dead. All right, we'll find Crap, there was a unit of 10 tacticals there. That's not ideal. <laughs> Only other shooting I got left, guys, is the Sakaran into the Galvabrac. Oh, wait. Two shots that are going to hit on fours. Pew, pew. Got a hit. Wound on a two. That is a wound, absolutely. Uh, what's the uh, AP on that? AP 1, AP strength one. 10. Strength 10, ooh. Oh, I don't love strength 10. That's not great. Uh, do I just put it on my... Uh, I might just put it on my Praetor. Screw it. <laughs> Gamble everything on this game on a 4-up right now. Woo. Why not? This game's already... <laughs> this game's beyond scuff for me already. He's alive! Oh, what a bullet. And then two, <laughs> two of his heavy bolters can see yeah. and are in range. Fours. Uh, for four hits. Boom, boom, boom. And are they toughness 5? Yeah, they're, they're T5, five. yeah. So, force to wound. Just one. Just one? All right. I'm going to do a uh, 
Probably a save on the uh, Galvor back on this one because they gotta feel no pain. They're good. They are That'll be the end of it. Ah, uh, damn good turn though. You just destroyed, you completely, you took this out of the game pretty much and then you destroyed that unit there. That was whatever, I'm not I'm not so upset about that. That feels bad. I hate yeah, that, I, I hate that for them. I thought I was gonna be lucky to get that and man, four, four shots, four hits uh, with night fighting and then four pens was Way overs for the, what I thought was going to happen there. The, the thing that makes me the saddest about that is the fact that it was a stupid Derradeo that did it. I'd be happy with you anything was, in the you game. Was, you respect old Boatface over no, here. No, I, I, literally anything in the game that did that would be okay, except the Derradeo. <laughs> the thing is a giant walking meme, and it, does, it, it, it doesn't do this to my word bearers. All right, fine. Word bearers turn one. Let's see if we can recover a little bit of this nonsense. Because this flank got so heavily pinned down, my plan was to move a little before, pop out, annihilate it with warp fire plasma, because it's quite a bit of shots, and then have the Ashen Circle go clean up the contents inside. Ideally, they'd be pinned, so I can overwatch. However, we're gonna do that next turn, maybe. <laughs> we're gonna hold on that. We can't do anything over here now. That's all done and fun. I'm literally not gonna move. Ah! No, I can't afford to move everything, because the Melter guy's just gonna destroy what's coming up here. I'll, I'll probably move out of Melter range, but that's like, to there, <laughs> realistically. Hindsight, I have to deal with that because I think you just move here, disembark here, and then melt in my face. So I'm I'm damned if I do, damned if I don't. So we're gonna activate our jump axe, pew, 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 and then we're gonna move all of this stuff. I'll show you where it ends up. That was easy. So we're just gonna jump forward. Uh, not too sure what the uh, plan of attack here is, but uh, we'll figure it out. And over to here, I did run the Galvor back. I am just running into a wall of flame here. Two squads of pirate no. class right in front of me. No. What's happening is the Terminators are walking up onto the bridge. I'm not shooting your Galvabrac, and we're going to have a throwdown on the bridge. It's going to be sick. Yeah, is that, is that the, uh, that, what that, is the character in there? There's no character in there, it's the captain. Yeah, it's just the just leader? Decide, gotcha. Decide, yeah. You're just going to have five fire drinks for Praetor, Galvorback, and a this chaplain? This is our world. Come get some. Let's do it. <laughs> I appreciate it. Absolutely. Okay, <laughs> then uh, the, rest is, the rest is done. Everything's moved. They can't move. They're pinned. Uh, we are on to shooting. I am gonna start with our, uh, you know what? I'm gonna start with this Mortat firing into the uh, the Rhino because this guy's strength six guns, it could pop it. And Absolutely. If I, if I pop it, I could charge what's inside. Yeah, boy. All right, so we're gonna try a chain. Uh, now I can't charge with a chain fire, so I'm just gonna chain fire and well, try just, and like. Just, just split off the Mortat. This Mortat split off from the squad? Uh, he could. He could do that. That's not a bad idea. Well, these guys could. Well, it depends on where you end up, too. If you disembark out of my charge range, you do, too. So he's going to stay with the squad just in case because he gets bended or something. I don't want him dying. I want him. Uh, he's freshly painted, so I don't actually expect much out of him. <laughs> but the cool thing about the Word Bearer Mortat is uh, weapons with the Gets Hot rule, if you roll one, uh, you have to stop the chain fire. But warp fires do not have Gets Hot, so you can fire them the full. You can just fire all your plasma. Full. Mortat goes burr. No, no stopping with the warp fire plasmas. And it's cool because he's corrupted, so he has a 12 inch aura of. Uh, uh, negative one leadership and those warp fires have pin pinning. Not that it'll matter for this, but like that's he's a damn good addition to any word bear army. He can utilize it pretty well. So I'm gonna do I can just do them all. These are three stakes of knife fighting. So we're gonna have oh, reroll that one. So we have uh, four hits there, and then we are gonna uh, we're strength six, so it doesn't go down to strength. So we need fives to glance. Yep. So we got a glance and a pen, and that's one of his pistols. I gotta double check if I can fire six shots with the other pistol as well. Just double checking, he's gonna fire the uh, other pistol six times as well. Uh, these miss, and then I need fives and sixes of glance here as well. So I got a glance and a pen, and I have a pen. So I got two pens and a glance. There should be no cover. Yep. So what are the pens? Not that it matters. Uh, nothing. So the guys inside have to take a, a snap fire check, leadership on them. Uh, they are gonna be fine with the two alone, yeah. yeah. And then are they pinned? Yes! Uh, <laughs> we got lucky! We got them pinned as well. <laughs> so they're pinned and it's wrecked, so I guess it's it's only fair. Uh, that's it, we're done here. We're done our, oh, we got last cannons. Those five last cannons are gonna try to annihilate that rhino there, because that's my uh, that's my target of choice. Yep, uh, so and because you got the signum, you can see it. Yes, I still hit on fours though. We got four hits, Ooh, that's a yeah. damn good start. Uh, you armor 11 on the front, so Sorry. we are gonna be pen, Dead. pen, pen, and then for, for dramatic effect, nothing. All right, cool. Does it go sky high though? You better believe it does not. A ping check. They're, they're not good. pinned. And the snap fire check. They're, they're good. good. Nice. So they're, they're, they're fully active. That rhino's dead though. And I get a dark favor, which means I get to augment one of my unit stats. Ooh. Favor of the dark gods will go on the Gal Vorbeck. Uh, because it's not a retinue, only they get the effect, not the two characters in it. So they get plus one movement, strength, and a uh, weapon skill and attack, I believe. You can have up to three favors. 
uh, around. I am going to then pick a new target. It's going to be the immobilized rhino in the back <laughs> uh -huh. there to get another favor of the dark gods. That's at the end of my turn, which is currently where we're at. We're done our turn. They're no longer pinned. Uh, they're free to go. They had nothing to shoot at, if anyone was curious, by the way. Uh, so that's why I didn't bother. They had... Oh! They could have shot, actually. I might actually shoot them into yeah. the, the couple guys I can see. These three dudes are going to take shots at them, but they didn't move, so they get to Fury, so it's going to be six shots. Ooh. It's going to be fours. And fours. Uh, two saves on that squad there. Sergeant! Oh. Two up. He's Sergeant. good. Sergeant! He's good. Eat them both. And that does remind me, the other squad of tacticals will fire into the approaching tactical squad. Ten shots on fours. Not bad. Four hits. And we... Just, just oh, that was a hit as well? Nice. That is three wounds. He's good, he's good. Excellent. Now my turn is done, because I got no charges to declare. So we're gonna go on to turn two for the salamanders here, and let's see what kind of havoc we can uh, unleash. Dalvorak and the uh, the fly drakes, we're gonna meet on the hill. This is Adam's insistence. I, I'm, I'm all for it, obviously. <laughs> um, what's the range on their, I think their range on their melters is only, um, 12, in which case... I believe they're regular... They are regular melter yeah. guns. So, um, I guess we're diverting to go kill some Ashen Circle with these lads. <laughs> You're gonna honor it, eh? <laughs> I'm gonna honor it, mate. Until they kill him, and then I'm gonna shoot him to death. Alright, so we'll, <laughs> I, we'll have our champion units. I'll honor it too. I'll clash your fire drinks. If you don't shoot me, I'm, I'll go break your fire drinks. I'm gonna meet you in the lava with the... With the oh. <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're up to four people. Four that's times. the fourth time it's fourth been knocked time. over. It's okay. It's uh, unstable at best, and it is unfortunately in the way for them. Where I decided to put a lot of my units. T's over here. All right, we got a few of them. Uh, just uh, only three of them because those two guys just hopped onto the rock oh, sure. there. Uh, one guy takes a wound. They they've got two wounds each. They should be two each. Yep. Yeah. They've got. It will not die, so we might get that wound back. That's just, true. Just for the lulls. <laughs> you know. So that entire tactical squad is just ran through the lava there. Bar, bar two guys, yeah. Sergeant first, and then, Sarge, and then anything else that matters. And then it'll be seven other dudes. Yeah. And uh, two of them. All right, two of them haven't done that song and dance. Experienced the lava before. Oh. They're, right. the, they're novitious. All right, what's next? <laughs> no. My ashen circle, dude. No. <laughs> Fire drinks. Jump onto the bridge. That's and right. then the other pyro class come up <laughs> away from the overhang there. As the movement is done, naturally they're pinned, can't move. He's stayed exactly where he is, can see everything he wants to shoot. These pyro class taking a wound, jumping through the lava, lava to wind up on some melter shots. Um, we're meeting on the bridge. <laughs> Galvarak uh, takes the fire drakes. I had to go through the lava at least. Epic Hopefully that makes it a little bit more even. Just I like how much you love the fire drakes though. <laughs> I do. Uh, I've run with this unit over here to reallocate my resources. Going through the lava, losing two guys here, which is funny, and the Sakaran just pivoted to look at some Ashen Circle. Um, so if I do pull down most of the Ashen Circle this turn, I'll feel pretty good. Um, only about two thirds of the squad here can see the tactical marines. Um, the other guys are, are going to sit still, but naturally, when the Galvarak do eat my terminators, <laughs> which is probably going to happen unless I just stonewall a three plus in you could. You do have the We're going to we're going to pick up the spare with uh, you know the minuscule amount that'll be left, obviously after I've had my way with you, <laughs> which uh, is probably going to be a full unit Galvarak. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to fail to kill him. I'm going to kill him down to two guys left, and those two guys are going to run through the rest of my army. Uh, into the shooting phase, we're going to go. We're, you're going to have some chances to do some reactions here. Yeah, what, um, are you, what are you thinking here? So I'm going to split fire because the Aeolus can shoot in a different target. Okay. So we're going to go the Aeolus into the uh, gray Ashen Circle. Okay. And then the uh, auto cannons into the red. They're going to hold. Look at that. You got the auto cannons. Auto cannons. Twos now, no knife fighting. All oh, hits. with the knife fighting, might still be around on a four up. It's gone. You're good. Yep, yep. Uh, so all hits, and then twos to wound. Fives will be AP two. Uh, there's one cocked. <laughs> one AP two. So one rend, one regular save. One rend, one regular save. Eh? Uh, that's from that buddy over yep. there into the red squad. Hmm. I don't want to do this. Uh, let's do. Ah, crap. I don't want to lose more. I was losing Ashen Circle, and then I'll do a three up save. We're good. And the bees in his chest. Oops, we linked. Nice. And then threes. One wound. One wound, three up. We're okay. Uh, three shots from the Aeolus into the other squad. Twos, and this is twos AP three. Ooh. Okay, nice. Three saves. Three. Uh, and I don't think I don't think the Sarge should get artifice armor. I, or I know I didn't buy it. I probably should in the future. Uh, we are gonna go ahead and just try and cover saves on that guy. Okay. He's dead. And then and he's not my sergeant. Right? And then one more is gonna be a regular dude, eh? Yep, one more. Blech. That'll be a morale check for them. Uh, next unit, we are gonna go with the Pyroclast. Pyroclast, shooting into this three. Whew. All right, 
Uh, do they, oh gosh, uh, I have two shooting phase reactions. I guess I'll evade, oh, I have to see if they're pinned. They're not pinned. That's from the, uh, the Bales. missiles. Yeah, uh, I will evade that, I suppose, because they're not fearless, so they will try their best. Peace. Melt us. Ooh, good start. Ooh, and twos. Damn. Ooh. We no cover for that one there, because these guys are all generally kind of in the open, so it's just shrouds. Shroud one, four die. Boom. Boom, and a boom. All right, we got the uh, six of these that can see. You're going to go for the attack squad. Oh. Six Volkites into the attack squad. <laughs> Here Threes we go. Threes now. Again. And we got twos. Got. Yeah. Okay. So take one out, take Ooh. two out. All three ups. Only six can die from this though, Ooh. but this is gonna be the flag rate. Only three, so we got three to flag rates. Uh, which is three more saves. So the three more guys could die. Uh, they don't. Uh, so it's gonna be three of these guys dead. Uh, bu, 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 bu. Uh, then we're gonna shoot with the tax squad into them. Would you like to return fire? Oh, that's tempting. Uh, they moved the last Terran, so there's only gonna be some shots. Eh, mm, no, I'll chill. I'll just let you shoot me. All right, not bad. And fours for three wounds. Uh, that's one more, or two more dead. Boom, boom, boom. And then, yeah, these guys are <coughs> taking a murder check. So the fire is the Venador. Uh, I feel like I'm piling it on this time, but I did line this up that you can pretty much only see the Ashen Circle. So that's okay. We're gonna follow through. Um, big gun. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, They're one, also gonna evade. One hit. Yeah. And two wounds. One wound, AP one, strength tenny. All right, we're gonna try an evasion. We do! Nice. Dodge the and shot. It is two heavy bolters that can see. Not bad. Good roll. And threes. Uh, four. Four, four saves. Do them all three ups. Uh, and then these are gonna be shroud. Oh, okay, Ooh. no damage. End of the phase, these guys do have to take a morale check because they got absolutely blasted. Uh, they are gonna, they're, <laughs> they're pinned. Uh, or, no, they're falling back. Oh, they're running. Yeah, they're running. Bye bye. Six inches. They're, they're breaking, they're running this way. Uh, we're playing the, the narrow ones. You just jump over it. No danger train, but like the larger, clearer ones. That's dangerous. Okay, uh, no charges. Uh, you could try and charge with the fire drakes if you wanted to. That's not how it works, buddy. Oh, okay, I'll charge you then. That's fair. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely, absolutely. I, can, I, can, I understand. I get it. We're on to turn two for the word bearers in this volatile game. Man, we are just dropping like flies on both sides. I'm gonna go ahead and activate our jump packs on the Ashen Circle and the Mortad over here. Uh, that is about it for starting moving phase things. We are going to reposition these tacticals and then we're gonna have the support squad try and take up that position. We're gonna have to do a lot of dangerous terrain checks though, but I'll show you where they end up first. They're gonna jump probably across the lava or something. They jump over to there, the tacticals moving up over the bridge and then the support squad has to, it's difficult terrain so it's minus two movement and then they jump in onto the bridge but every single one of them had to trudge through that uh, difficult terrain. So the sergeant, I'll go, uh, uh, actually, yeah, the sergeant there first. Uh, he's okay, and then the rest are just uh, apothecary. How about you? You're good too. Seven remaining dudes on twos. Uh, oh, three more die. All right, oh, my let's, just, let's just gotta be uh, one in the end, one in the- Do they the, get feel no pain against it? No, no feel no pains, only in bones, and then one up front. And that's, uh, that'll be a morale check for him at the end, of, uh, right now, essentially. They are, oh, <laughs> they are good. That's, uh, we're already down to five. That's okay, totally fine. See if we can rally these tactical Marines over here. Leadership, good, they rally. Move their initiative, they can snap fire later. Uh, I'm gonna move all these Galvor back through all this nonsense and uh, hope for the best. Gonna roll, they're all gonna take danger train checks. We're gonna start with these three. They're all good. And then we're gonna do the three in the back. They're all good. Uh, the Praetor is gonna pass and the Chaplain. Well, wow, they all make it, no problem. Meant to be. They're all slow down, though. Meant to be. There, that's how they end up. We're going to have to take another one as they charge, but they, they passed the first one flying colors. I'm sure they'll do the second one. Well, three of them won't have to do it, but the, the, the rest will be fine, totally fine. Uh, we're, I believe we're done moving. We're going to go on to shooting. I am... Uh, let's actually spread this out a little bit, because he's got a psychic power I might want to use. Or he might use his pistol. I'll figure that out later. I actually don't know. I kind of know what a psychic power does, but I can't quite remember. Did forget about the salamander, he will not die on the one guy. No, no, no he's gonna keep on dying. It's, absolutely. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and do, uh, how many shooting phase reactions do you have? Um, I, only one. I get two in the assault phase. Okay, well let's go ahead and fire these tacticals first into your pyroclast and see what we can get. Would you like to return fire or evade? Let me have a quick look about other... <laughs> Is your reaction here? I will react. Good, good chance they'll get pinned or completely destroyed. Kind exactly of, uh, right, so reacting. let's not bank on that. So threes. Nice, alright, one miss. And miss. twos to smush. Oh, you'll get cover. Go I'll get some cover, just yeah, six four. up, so. Four of them? Nice. At uh, six up cover, uh, five up on the one guy. Actually, I'll do five ups on those guys back. Oh, they're not in range. I have to do the saves on them, so they'll have six up from the crappy little walls here. Uh, oh, two, hey. two, uh, two die, uh, but they all shoot two. Uh, I'll just say you and you die, 
Okay, for dramatic effect, there we go, boom. After everything is said and done, 14 shots back at the Salamander Pyroclast. Freeze to hit. Ba -ba 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 and uh, forced wound here, uh, but and you're all two up, so you got four, five, six, seven saves. To kill the one wounded lad. I do. do. Got him. Not a morale check, though. I got to kill one more guy. Uh, we are going to do the warp fire into them and try our best. Only these two can see because these guys are too low and the tacticals are in the way. Go for the best here. Boom, boom, boom. Got a hit. That's all we need, baby. Uh, it does wound as breaching, so you it's have a six, six up cover. Oh, that's a, one takes away. that's a pitting check as well. Ooh, I love it. At minus one because you're near corrupted units. So, uh, at least you have seven. <laughs> good. Uh, oh, sorry, I, let me just check if they're They might be good. They might they, be yeah, we'll they're perfectly fine because uh, they're nine to, at the top. From there, we're going to move on to the Mortat and his Ashen Circle firing into this squad, uh, this support squad here. And you know what you uh, want to change and just, just ice the squad? I would like to just uh, shoot a couple of regular shots, yeah. You don't have the reaction anymore, right? No, not the shooting face. All right, so then I'll just do regular ones here. Ah, oh, but I, yeah, I, maybe I'll get lucky and pin you off the two shots. We're gonna shot, shoot once with each pistol. He hits twice, and two's to wound. Uh, both breaching, two kills. Boop, and then it'll just be a pinning check. And his unit's corrupted. Seven, oh, you're good. Boss. Yeah, because you should be eight on the high end. They are, they're uh, fancy, uh, they're, they're standard Akatic hand flamers. Placed myself in a beautiful teardrop pattern for you, so hit them all. Seven, seven hits per, per guy. Yes, 21, 21 hits. These are a forced wound. Uh, that one's off the screen there. And then I just only 20, so there we go. That's all 21 wounding hits. I think in the 12s, he is actually the closest guy, so thematically <laughs> I do like this. Oh, ah, there he goes. Ah, there he goes. He's the dead. rest are threes. And uh, the threes. That's one dead, plus an additional two. Two dead. That right, that's right. There will be a morale check at the end of this shooting phase. Which I think is now. Uh, pre yeah, pretty much. I'm not shooting anything else at them. So here's the morale. They are seven now. Uh, that's, needs to be a one. No, they're uh, falling back. All right, they're out of here. Bye bye. You go eight. eight inches. Four left, and they're fleeing the battlefield for now. They're fleeing underneath, but we're putting them on the upper level to just show where they are. Just underneath. so you guys can see them. And also, so you don't forget them under there. That's correct. To resolve this guy's uh, nonsense over here. Summon Hellfire with his uh, discipline. I got the pinning pistol, but the chance of actually pinning them is like catastrophically low. So we're just going to shoot Hellfire at them. My psychic check to use the power because it's a psychic focus, and then it's just a template. It's the regular one too, so it's nothing too fancy. I'll hit like three guys. Four guys. Sure. Four. Oh yeah, I can do four. Yeah, four. I got four hits. Boom. Uh, strength seven. Nice. Deflagery. He's wound on twos. Uh, running six up. So you just have uh, two, two up saves. Up. But they're in heavy, so it should be able to reroll it. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, you're good. All good there. Uh, that is. Uh, they have bolt spitters, and you know what? I'll do the bolt spitters. I hate doing the little dinky shots, but I might need it. Twelve shots with the bolt spitters. There you go. Threes. And four to wound. Uh, that's two saves. I'm gonna throw in a bull pistol from the chaplain. Hit. Uh, that's just two saves. Two ups. You're okay. That's it. We are now done shooting. Oh, these guys can snap fire. They rallied. It's gonna be five shots snap firing at them. I'm loving our little tactical squad off, just like yeah. exclusively on this side of the table. I'm strictly just losing. Nothing else exists for those two <laughs> units. Kill each other. Oh, two hits. Oh, oh, oh. One save. Oh, a death. Oh no. We got Let's one of them. Uh, the bulk, yeah, bulk gun, yeah, bye-bye. Can't really declare charge with those guys are out in the open, but they did work. They did a good job. Uh, we're going to declare charge nationally over here, and I assume we want to do your fancy reaction. So you can you can charge them if you want. I could, it's a nasty. I'll try. I'll roll it up. Uh, yeah, I, can't, I, can't, the, I can't react. You can't react. Uh, it's a pretty long charge. It's I got the jump packs active. Uh, Sure. Nope, they fail. They'll surge forward uh, three. They're going to jump over. One of them's going to stagger a little bit and land in the lobby. He not roll a one. Ah, oh, we're good. Six. A little bit closer. And uh, over here. We're going to charge here. I see. You have. You want to use your Salamander reaction here? Salamander once per game. Come at me, bruh, is essentially what it says. I, it's, I, I can't. I, I read it in the book, and all I saw was, come at me, bruh. It's a uh, lot of words yeah. that essentially equate to that. <laughs> My charge up, I get plus one. I don't think I get plus one with characters in there, but we make it with an eight. It'll be down to a six, though, because of the train. Uh, Praetor, he's okay. Chaplain. He's okay. These guys run through lava day and night, dude. That's actually pr regular regime on a word bearer ship is running through lava. The other three dudes. Okay, one of them, on the other hand, doesn't take. Oh, one, two, three. It was, oh, unfortunately, my guy over there takes the damage. He doesn't have an involved. They have feel no pains now, but he's got two wounds left. You know what? Before I fully commit to this charge, I should probably fire my heavy weapons at the rhino over there. It's going to be five shots. Pew! They all hit but one, actually. And two's to glance. Uh, two's to, yeah, two's to glance. That's 11. I want to re-roll them, though, because I want pens. I'm greedy. Throw out four pens. You got six up cover saves because there's intervening units in the way. 
He doesn't matter dead. <laughs> dead. Does he go sky high? He does. Does. It's going to affect everything within one inch, which Never is nothing. Never mind, and it can't hurt this, can it? Cannot hurt that. Uh, it's strength eight. I don't know if it can, but. Uh, yeah, it should be. So or, on a five or a six, or you should roll this. Uh, strength, strength five or six. Strength eight, nothing. No. Boom. Just a little below back. And that is out of here. That's another destroyed rhino. And another dark favor point. I gotta see when I allocate that because I'll probably do it uh, right now if I can. Sign that dark favor immediately to the, uh, the, the Galvor back. So they're Galvor back with two favor points on them. Quite scary. I'll uh, we'll go closest, closest. And then the rest is just gonna oop, meet up in honorable combat as the bridge slides on down. I'm stubborn nine. Nice. You are, yeah, you're stubborn damn good. <laughs> it's pretty nice. Uh, that's uh, my charge in there, and uh, we go to, you're all Thunder Hammers. Do you want to issue a challenge? They're all Chosen Warriors. Do you want to, I'm not going to bother. We're all Chosen Warriors here. So. Yeah, okay, no, I'm not going to. So it's just like fight for, fight for the sake of fighting. Uh, I will, the Praetor goes first, then the Chaplain, all the Galvor back, except for that one's got a Power Fist, and then he'll go at the same time as the Fire Drakes. But with Dark Favor, every point of Dark Favor increases your weapon skill by one, your strength by one, and your, and your movement by one. To our first with five attacks, uh, hitting on. He's still up skill six. You're only up skill six. I'm weapon skill six as well. Ooh, okay. So nice. fours, but you get to really got a champion there, yeah? Oh, I do have a champion. Yeah, I actually mastercraft his weapon, knowing yeah. I was gonna put a champion in there. So, <laughs> oh, they all hit by one. Yep. These are strength five, so these are threes to wound. Unless your toughness goes up. Ah, uh, nah. All right, you got two killing blows. You have to do those first. So three up involves on the killing blows. You'll carve uh, one up. Lost the dude. And, and then, then just two three ups. Two three ups. One uh, damage. One one took, takes a wound. All right. And then the chaplain goes next. He's got uh, five attacks. He's got. He's also got five attacks because he doesn't have a specialist weapon. Uh, he's web skill force to hit, hatred. And then these are strength seven or six or two to wound. But you have your full two up. Boom. Uh, good. You're good. Nothing there. And then the gal Vorback dark brother and without power fists are gonna pile in. So here's three guys. Oh, thank you. And you got They're all in base contact or close enough to it. So this is four of them attacking at weapon skill seven. Uh, this is them with rage and all that, and they get to reroll because the chaplain. And the reroll for chaplain. All right, we got two misses. Oh boy. Wounding on twos, but the only thing that matter are sixes. So we got three sixes, which are killing blow and rending. So three three ups. Oh, oh two another two. He just got, kills two <laughs> of them. And these are all two ups, yeah? These are all two ups, yeah. It's fine, it's totally fine, absolutely fine. Two ups. Twos. And you lose one more wound, not bad. Not so I've lost three so far, and one's got a wound taken. So that means you'll have the champion, the fire the fire drake master. Will be no, the... so I've got one left. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, yeah. and him. I've lost two, and he's got one wound left. Correct. You should have one more Galbar, that's four out of the five. So it'll be five more attacks. Pull, pull, re roll. That's all hit. And two's to wound. Uh, no instant death, so just uh, two ups. You still bring that guy right. down. Just the sergeant hanging tight. Whew. All right, and then we go at the same time. Ooh. I will get to kill one of these guys. I, um, I don't suspect. I don't, I don't, I wouldn't be surprised. So their toughness doesn't go up, does it? Uh, they're tough, no, they're, no, they're all just T5. Uh, when T5. does the pluses and multipliers happen here? Because these plus one strength, does that mean he's strength 10? Nine, yeah, through the, you still, because it's, yeah. it's uh, the, uh, you still have to do the order of operation there. That's what I thought. Yeah. So you're hitting on fours, re-rolling ones. Yeah, so we'll both pile in. You'd go, boop, I'd go up and around. Here, this guy's kind of stuck. Let's rolling once. Oh, because they're got. Yeah, that's a hit, and yeah, a wound. A wound. Uh, Minus a bunch. Uh, just to feel no pain on that one. And you saved it. You say I got the five <laughs> up. Yeah. All and, right. See if you power fist. Uh, he's got specialist weapon. No, he's got five attacks on the charge as well because they don't have paired weapons. Boom, boom, boom. And these are twos, and these are ah one, one save. You're good. Oh, he's nice. alive. I actually don't like that. Stubborn nine. Stubborn nine. I didn't want him to live. I know. And he holds oh, two. No way. This is the worst, oh, worst outcome, everybody. Gosh. This is <laughs> the worst, the darkest timeline. <laughs> this is the worst outcome. I was hoping, I was honestly hoping I'd wipe him out, and then you just like annihilate him with all the shooting. That, this that's kind fine. of, I was This hoping. is hilarious. You'll make it work. Yes. I'm sure. <laughs> oh no. He's got two wounds left. Well, that'll end the turn. I gotta pick a new target uh, to kill for Dark Favor here. Might they, be this one. <laughs> uh, that's a that's a damn good idea, Adam. Actually, I, did, I, I honestly didn't even I didn't even think about it. I was looking at other vehicles, pirate class. I'm like, you know what? Let's go with that guy there. Yeah. Now I can't put too much more Dark Favor on them. I can only do one more. So I gotta think about spreading it out a little bit now. They probably have enough. Not only did the uh, the meat on the bridge. Backfire. It backfired worse and better at the same time. I thought I was going to kill half the unit and die, probably. Um, but then I died, didn't kill any of him, except for one guy who's holding them there and stopping them from 
Especially getting shot at. Yeah. But because of that, I think my hands are pretty much tight. We're just going to go for everything else. And that's going to be my whole army getting absolutely annihilated by this unit <laughs> of Galvabrak running through me. And we'll see if it's enough to win me the game. First up, I need to rally these boys. Rally? They yes. do. Ooh, heroic, nice. Oh, the heroically valley, and they move forward four, yeah? Which yeah, they just do their initiative, pop out there. It's like, hey, what's up there? Get some <laughs> snaps. You're back again, eh? Mm. Yeah, yeah, you thought. You thought you're locked in here with us, I'm locked in here with Yeah, you get the idea. I feel like uh, I see six fours coming my way, or four sixes. Probably go for the, um, probably go for the plasma squad, if I can get in range, because that's as far as I can move, and then I need to be within 12 inches from there. Naturally, oh yeah, plenty of range, yep. Yeah. So, within 12 inches, seven, seven, seven. Yeah, so maybe about three of them will get to attack. Okay. We'll get they are coming up, and they are looking to square off against my support team of plasmas. Yeah, looks like we have a good range here. Yeah, we've got good range. We, I think we can kill exactly three of them, but if I can kill three of them... I only got five, so... Yeah, exactly, that's enough. Um, and then, of course, you could shoot back, you shoot in reaction, but I'm sitting in there in nice cover with my two-up save, and I'll get a five-up cover, so hopefully if you do return fire, not too bad. Do you get two reactions in the shooting phase? That's or? the phase I get two Exactly right, yeah, yeah. so I figure out that's going to be one, or they're going to martyr them. Um, these pyros are going to move over, and they're going to go for the Ashen Circle and the Mora Mora Oh boy. I can't really move away from any of this stuff here that I want to. Can't move out of their range, uh, and I don't want to move them too much further back. They're, uh, they're tempted to move back, and that's tempted to move back, because I don't want to... But I don't want to go through the terrain again. So I am... Dang. Do you have any weapons in that squad? Or just chain in, swords and stuff? In the... Pyro class squad. Uh, just a Parax. Parax and just, and yeah, but, uh, melee weapons. Mm. I guess I, uh, I'm still gonna, I'm gonna run away, but I have to do dangerous train checks. I'm gonna withdraw, is what I'm saying. Yep, dangerous trains on the fire class squad. They're, They're all, all good. good. Excellent. They live in the fire. They live, they do literally live in the fire. These guys are all gonna do dangerous train, there's four of them. So I'll do the Mortat, he's okay. And then the three honored friends. Uh, they're all good. So they are going to end up about here. They're withdrawing away from them. Not going to do much overall, but maybe I won't get charged as easily. Through the <laughs> fire as well. <laughs> they're just gonna pushing. Have There's seven attacks. This is our little This is our little mini mini battle over here. And I lose one guy. Again, not really, you know, born in the fire too much. <laughs> not forged in the fire like the others. Uh, back as he physically can. He doesn't want to tangle with last cannon. Oh, I could just hide him. I could just... Could? Just... just Whip, 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 whip. Suspect I'm going for vehicles I as my blood feud target? Well, you've been trying to kill. You've had Terminators, you've had Pyroclasts, and you're, you're going for the Rhinos. So <laughs> statistics say. <laughs> Might be going for the Rhinos in this blood feud. Uh, so I'm going to try and hide this one, conserve a few points. Maybe he comes out and goes for Galvabrak in a turn or two. He could pop two a turn. Yeah, he could. I oh, he's got the heavy bolters. Maybe he gets another. Um, so they've lost one for the DTs. They haven't lost any. Um, and we are on to the shooting phase, guys. All right, where do you want to start? Um, we'll go with the ones that uh, we know it's going to happen. So the Volkites, who can't sh really shoot anything else, are going to go for the tactical squad. Ah, interesting. Is now the time to do it? The Dark Martyrdom. <laughs> so two of them can't see, so it'll be eight, which I'm sure will be plenty. I, I think I'll use my stratagem here. I'm yep. going to Dark Martyrdom this one. So this so, is the word bearer unique one, where one guy is removed. He stands in front of 50 Volkite shots, or I guess in this case, 40. <laughs> he dies, and then that's it. Then the rest of everyone else is fine. No deflagrate, no nothing, just the squad is done. There we go. All right, we'll move on to the other stuff here. <laughs> so we'll go for uh, four Melter shots into the plasmas. And they'll return fire. Of course. Yeah, this blows my reactions yep. done. Um, so this is uh, threes. Nice, and twos, and you'll have a couple of five up or six ups. Five, yeah, five up there. Three, three wounds. I can only kill three of them anyway. True. I can only shoot back with three of the guys, really, anyways, because these guys can't see too well. But I have three saves, three yep. covers. Three covers. Boo, 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 boo. I make two of them. So two down. But one guy's going to get pasted. We'll say he dies. And then my three guys are going to Oh, is that five back. up? Five, it's five up sure. for walls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. These two are rapid firing. Oh, plus him, too. Yeah, plus well. the guy, yeah. Yeah. So, so six shots. Boop. I hit on, oh, just those two. And they don't get hot. That's what the warp fire thing is. And Two's, I have one breaching, nothing, one and nothing, one's breaching, exactly. uh, which will be a five up. Yep. You are oh, one damage. One takes a wound. Oop. Got it. Pinning check. No corrupted nearby though. So. Uh, but they're leadership nine. A okay. Four, four snap shooting, snap shooting melter pistols, melter guns. So these are the snap shots. Ooh, nothing. Dodge them. And then the five yeah. um, fire class. Huh. Ooh, not good. A couple and hits. Twos. One, only one save, AP Bajillions. That is going to annihilate an Ashen Circle. One of the Corrupted ones. Ah, do they have an involved save? I don't think so. I'm gonna, uh, No, they don't. Corrupted don't. They Corrupted have a rule where they automatically pass morale checks, but take D3 wounds. What are so uh, Adam just asked what these the weapons are in combat. They are uh, standard uh, hand, rake, hand rake axes. Yep. 
That's that. You don't know what a handrake axe does? No. What a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Pyroclast have shot. We've got the Duradeo next. And he's going to go everything except the Aeolus here. The Aeolus at the support squad. <gasps> Boo. All right, well, bring it on. Aeolus is hitting on twos. Good start. Wounding on twos, and you'll have a five up on a couple guys. That's that three of them. Three of them, AP threes. All right, so just those two guys are going to cover. That guy's probably too far. So we got one dead, and then the other guy alive. Okay, so. Cool. Twos re rolling. We got a good twin link, yep. Nice. One miss, and then twos, fives are breaching. Uh, one save, one AP2. So do the two up save on the Mortad. Or it's good. good. Nice, good. And then uh, AP2, yep. uh, that's a uh, dead, ooh, is that a dead guy to me? Yeah, if, uh, he's just gonna fall over dead. That's, I'm rolling for no reason. <laughs> okay. Then we're gonna keep the sergeant, and we got the heavy bees. Twin heavy bolter. All Four right. hits, nice and the threes. That is uh, two wounds. Two more. I'm gonna do one at a time on the Mortat. He's good. Uh, he's not good. One That's damage. A We're done firing at them now. Yes, yeah, so the only thing I could fire is that tactical over there. And actually, I'm gonna choose not to because I wanna make the charge and I don't wanna make my charge any harder. So we're gonna right. choose not to fire there and move straight into the charge phase. They're gonna be the first one. I do owe you a couple morales though. So yep. the, the Mortat squad, yep. they do have to check. Please don't fail. Oh, that's a bad start. Ooh. That's a bad follow-up. All right, so they are corrupted. I got. I think they actually might die. I have to double check that. And then over there, their leadership, good to go. Good. This is a bad time to fail a morale check for them. So they're gonna suffer D3 wounds with no saves of any kind allowed, including damage mitigation rolls. I have two wounds left in the unit. They're gone, they die, they dissipate. All right, well, the Mortad had a good run though. I'm actually freshly paid a model. He did more than I thought he was really good, yeah. yeah. The quest of this game will continue. Right. Not only, everything else is just a sideshow compared to the mighty battle this, between these two attack squads. I, I guess I'll see what you charge. I'll decide. I'll probably, well, I'll probably it's hold. My, it's my only other charge, so feel free to do whichever reaction, every reaction you feel I'm like. True, I'm probably gonna overwatch, but uh, do, 11, that'll welcome. Do it. I'll overwatch. Two dangerous changes for the back two guys, and they're, and they're both fine. So I have 10 shots coming at you. They're gonna be threes to hit. Okay, they all hit. Oh, one missed. Forced wound. We got three saves. Ah, uh, sergeant tanking time. Oh, oh we knew it. Rip. I knew it. Oh, no. And then two three ups. You're good. We're good. So, oh. But I got the charge and I have bayonets. You, I have nothing. I just got uh, regular dudes. Uh, ten attacks. Uh, you get the extra one for charging. That's what, that is the ten attacks. Oh, yeah, you have bayonets. Yeah. Do you have yeah. chain bayonets or just regular bayonets? Uh, chain bayonets. Oh, so we got shred. Nice. Two fours. Not a bad Ooh, start. Bad. And then threes re rolling. Oh boy, here's hoping I, I don't have artificer armor or anything in there, so. Uh, five so far, five, six. Six. Three up saves, let's go. You cut down two. Two. We'll say you die and you die, leaving the sergeant alive. Our sergeant was kind of, there's a, I, I didn't point him up, but he's always the guy kind of around the pillar here. So he'll go in, I guess they fight at the same time though. So they those do. two guys yeah, get to fight as fight. well. Yes, so I'll have five attacks back. Five whole attacks. Fours, ooh, and fours. Suffer, one save. You're good. All right. So one by two. One by two. I'm leadership down to five. No matter, well, we break now. <laughs> Chasing. Dead time. Oh, that's a good roll too. Oh, get out, out, of here. out of here. Oh, and you get to uh, my, consolidate. My tax. Oh, nice. you drone. Freaking did it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Side quest. Gonna lie, um, a little disappointed. <laughs> do I consolidate any direction, or do I have to go towards them? Any direction up to your initiative. Yeah. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you're just gonna keep pushing. They're not gonna. They are not gonna do anything to contribute to this. Do something over there later. Right. Let me just get him out of here. Uh, it's up to you if you want to pull him, if you think he's got to go in for- you know what? He's, right. gonna, he's gonna make all his three ups. <laughs> he could. And he's just gonna be like, mate. All right. I'm taking you with me. Well, Praetor does start first. A four attacks with his mastercrafted power sword. Uh, we are gonna have two misses. Mastercrafted though. Okay. Oh. And, no, Paragon Blade, I should say. I'll reroll that. Uh, we have one wound. Three up. They're good. good, okay. Uh, chaplain will go next with his four attacks because he's got two weapons. Uh, he's a chaplain, so he doesn't get Mastercraft weapons. I have up skill five, so that's a miss. And two, so you have two up saves. So um, I am only weapon skill five now, down from down from six, because that was only for that turn. Yeah. So two ups, we're good. You're right, okay. Then I got uh, some Galvor back with three attacks each. The rest of the Galvor back attacks, there's only three each now, hitting on, and no re-rolling either. So three's to hit because the web skill big. And we need sixes. Well, we don't need them, but we want them. Sixes are ideal. So I do one, one six, six, and the rest are twos to wound. But you just have your uh, full save. The one three up to rule them all. He's good. And then and we then have five, five two ups. ups. Yeah, because he's very P3. He's oh! Taken one. He's got one wound, and one then I- One wound, you got the power fist guy, just go for it, and then I'll hit back. Fight at the same time here. Threes to hit, and twos to wound. And they're oh three ups. Oh my god. First one. Ah, oh, he he's okay. gone. So he you do strike back swing. though. Uh, hitting me on fives. Fives. Ooh. Oh, damn. 
All right. Two wounds. Uh, I have to put them on the Gale Vorback. These are just field of pains. I make neither. You crush him. I got one. Yeah, you kill, you kill the Power Fist, too. Woo! I have to lose the Power Fist because he took a wound on the dangerous terrain checks earlier. And after they clean up the Fire Drake, they will consolidate there. And then that will give me another Dark Favor, which I will put on the Praetor. So he'll have the Dark Favor himself because they're probably going to split off now. This guy's got, it will not die over here. Oh, damn. Oh, close. That's in the six. I thought it might not die. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, that should be I'm sad about, I'm, Now I'm sad with the Mortad. I was really excited to chain fire again with him, but he's got a giant bull's eye on his head. I get it. Okay, so my turn now as we go into the third round of the game. Pick a new target for sacrifice. I was probably just going to pick that Melta squad. Uh, the, not the Pyro class, but the Melta squad themselves. And uh, moving on to actual movement, I am going to have... It's kind of tough because they're both pretty nasty on the Overwatch. Don't love it either way. Yeah, I guess I'll just, uh, I'm going to move towards, but I was going to split off and go two ways, but I think I'm just going to do Disorder Charge or try to. So we're going to move these guys first. They actually get plus two to their move for the Dark Favor. They move seven. Oh, no, they move nine inches. <laughs> well, they're like possessed in 40k now. So there's really not much choice of me trying to run away from you four inches. It's still going to be an auto charge. So what's the other shoot reaction? Is move towards you, right? Uh, you can move directly towards me um, as well. Is it before you move? It's after I move. After you move. Yeah. Okay. So we're just going to go, we're going to use that to get these guys here. And they're going to go up and around. They're avoiding so, the train. Damn, because the way this was going to go, I was planning to use this unit to get in front of the Pyro class. Right, yeah, I got um, a little too but close But you just, you're, just, you're able to get too close anyway because you moved yeah. so far. So, not going to do that. I will just, I'm just going to move away with the yep. Pyro class. Bye-bye. I'll draw you uh, as, uh, into my firing arc. Actually, the better firing arc is theirs, and you're moving out of that right now already. I'm trying my best to stay out of their yeah, arc. You're yeah, you're doing yeah. good. So, I'm going I'm to move the Pyro class as far as they can go. Um, he might take a DT. Um, Bye bye. Four inches, just to pull you away. Poss it is a possibility you fail a make a fail a four inch charge. Good. And uh, well, it should be five inch charge because you're an inch away. Um, and one DT. All right, one dangerous train, which will be a five. You're good. good. Be it for that move. I'm gonna keep these las cannons still, and then over to here I have to deal with these pyro class. I'm gonna keep the legionnaires still, and I'm gonna these guys. What I got four guys going through dangerous train here, and they're gonna try and get up there. Got the apothecary and three dudes, so apothecary is okay, and then three dudes. Oh, they're all good. Nice. All right, the lava claims no more word bearers this day. They're staying still because yep. they want a fury. fury. Yeah, and then that's that's it for a well, while. That was a quick move phase. Uh, let's start with the fury. Uh, we'll go there first, and we are going to fire into the power class. So you got 21 shots. You got seven guys there. Yes, exactly that actually. Would you like to return fire or anything like that? They've still got little bolt bolty guns, yeah. Uh, they got little bolty guns over there, yeah. You might not shoot them. Now, I'm probably not going to shoot them, yeah. though, yeah. If I, but if I hold the reaction, you're definitely not going to shoot them. 100% I won't shoot them, yeah. <laughs> so there's no real point, because I don't think they're going to hurt me anyway. No. You, know, you, go, you make the charge, or you don't, and you kill me. You're not going to shoot them, because I'll make a charge harder, so I will shoot back here. Okay. Uh, unless you're going to shoot with them next. What's their range? They're 24-inch range. Up to 24. Up to 24, yeah. yeah so they could shoot here. Um... Holding the reaction, so I'll do the 21 shots. Three is to hit with my 21 shots. Four is to wound. That's only going to be four saves. Beautiful. One more knock around. That's five. That's only five. five. It's five. Okay. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Close. Okay. Almost six. Okay. Okay. Almost okay. six. Almost six. Uh, I've got one guy in a wound here. Let's hope he doesn't die. He's he does good. Not die. Excellent. Great roll. So then I will go with my plasma squad. They're going to do the same thing. They're going to fire at them. And, I'll uh, return fire. Yeah, hopefully hopefully I pin you. So you don't yep. have to. <laughs> Six shots on threes. We've got three hits. And these are breaching four up. Otherwise, two's to wound. That's three wounds. Three so breaching. Um, I do have the cover of five up. OK. Oh, so one dies, one takes a wound. And then you got oh, one pinning check. Yep, uh, pinning check on a nine. Ooh, Ooh they're pinned. They're pinned, no That's reaction. Big. That's big, yep. Oh, warp fire coming in big here. Uh, I did not expect that. That's fine. Uh, that's okay. Uh, that's it for shooting over here. I got the Laz Cannon team. So does that mean my reaction's wasted? I actually don't know if it's wasted. I know it can't. You can't react if you're pinned. I'll double check in a second uh, because I'll, I'll fire here, which you could return fire, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I guess I have to look in that because you probably want to return fire up here. So I'll just volley into them. <laughs> They're too close. <laughs> They're too close, dude. Oh, oh no! They, they were so focused down that way. It just didn't work out. Okay. And the return fire. Please. Excellent. And fours, have you got an artificer in there? I do, yes. Good stuff. He is in Sarge. Uh, four wounds. Four wounds. I'll do two ups one at a time. Keep him alive. Oh, that's okay. That worked out. You're I got good. lucky. Yeah. That will conclude. Well, I guess I could shoot over here. I will. I'll put the warp fire pistol into them. 
And then I'll do the bolt spitters. As, I'm not gonna bother with the bolt spitters. I'm just gonna do the warfare pistol. Don't like shooting all the stupid, the bolt spitters aren't, ah. Yeah. Uh, we got a hit, he's a Praetor. Uh, it's a wound, no breaching, so just your three up safe. You're A-OK, -okay. all right, cool. And then ah, I'll do the bolt. I wanna risk killing them because I need to do a double charge. So if I kill them, I can't charge at all. So I'm not gonna risk it. I am gonna go on to charging, which will be that squad of Galvor back and the characters. Gonna eat a lot of Overwatch here, uh, but we're gonna charge uh, a disorder charge. We're gonna charge both units. I yeah, will charge that. They'll be the primary, they'll be the secondary target. Yeah, so they wall of death on a D6 instead of a D3. Yeah, they got that fancy flamer. Yeah, yeah, do you think that's better than the melter guns? I'd probably, I'd, oh, the melter guns aren't They're strength six wall of death as well, so they win you on threes. I'd probably, ooh, I'd, ooh, I only have a three up save. I'll get yeah. a feel no pistol. The thing is, I'll get a three up save against it, but it's a hell of a lot more shots. Hmm. But you got you have three wounds, don't you? I do, yeah. The three and it's going to take three melter shots to kill a guy, and that's if you don't make a five up. Correct. Yeah. So, so yeah, the wall of flame. Argu uh, arguably, these guys kill maybe one. Wall of flame could spike and do yeah. some phenomenal stuff. Plus, it's fun as hell. Yeah. We're doing the wall of flame. Five d six Overwatch. All right, and that's going to be. Yikes! No, a, not great. Oh, never mind. Uh, it was the opposite of quite a bit of hits. It's eleven. Eleven. Ooh. All right. Well, yeah. still wounds on three. Take out three of those, and there should be eight saves. Okay. Well, three ups. Which we have a doctor or feel no pain, we take a damage. See how well they charge. Uh, they seven. Yep. Yeah. They're a okay. This guy will go poop, poop, poop to there, and then exactly that. They're all. They don't get any. They don't get the rage. They get nothing. Should still be enough. But hopefully, possibly it's the power class live. Yeah, they still got the two. You, you're happy yeah. for them to live, right? I would love, love yeah, that. Absolutely happy if they live. That is my only charge because they rapid fired. Uh, so we're gonna go right onto this combat where I have my Praetor swinging first at the highest initiative. Uh, two threes to hit. Uh, ma rolling. Master. Ah, oh, do I get hit? Yeah, for yeah, hatred. Yeah, hatred. hatred, yep. And then these are gonna be. Two to kill. Two. Ah, oh, these are strength five, so threes. Threes. So, uh, is that two two dead? Yeah, he kills two of the multi melters. Yep. Oh, uh, not multi melters, the, the melter melters, squad. Yep. And then the chaplain will pile. I'll just pile him in a second. He'll swing next with four, three attacks. Oh, four attacks against two weapons? Yep. Three. Yeah, four, yeah. He doesn't get the charge bonus, though. Uh, hitting on threes with hatred. And then we are looking at. Uh, fours to wound. No, sorry, twos to wound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no AP though. Three saves. Well, these are actually AP three. The power models are just AP three oh, base. Yeah. Yep. So like, he crashes two of them. Boom, boom, boom. Dark favor, and then that would have been him piling. It actually wouldn't be able to pile in too much. And then they'll pile in and put as many attacks into them. As Fifteen they can. attacks. All of them. Yep. Here they are. Three stickers. We're up to kill seven, and we do have hatred. Thank you. Uh, one miss. This is new. That's you one for this tally. One. one for that one. Uh, These twos. Strength five. Uh, they don't get. Do they get strength? They get movement, oh, strength, no. and weapon skill. Yeah, uh, they do. Yeah, two. Twos. Six is what we, what we don't want. So we got two. One six. That's it. Boom. So that's murder. Strike kills them. One's just dead. One's just and dead. And these are twos. All twos. Yep. And they are going to suffer a further two. So one, one dead, more dead. Two yep. more dead. Boom. 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 I guess if I gave them one more dark favor, they'd be strength eight, instant deathing everything. But that, at this point, I don't really need that anymore. A okay. Super, a bit superfluous. Yeah. <laughs> you may go. Aha. And fight uh, back. Aha. I do have a Good power axe in the squad. Going on fives. Hey. Nice. And fives. One wound. And we are going to save with armor. And the power axe. Fives. Nothing. Oh, he does miss. All right. Lost by a million. Quite a bit. Let's see what you roll. Um, Five. Assuming that's a fail. Leadership Eight. nine. Down to one less because I cause fear. Yep. So definitely a fail. Yeah. So I will chase. I'll try to. I'll roll that again. Oh yeah. Uh, one. One. Oh, we're gonna catch you. Oh, they're gone. Towards the uh, the Volkites. I'm thinking we're gonna go towards the Derideo. I'm thinking. Not able to fully clear the pipe, and I don't really want to take dangerous train, so we're just gonna end up there. It wouldn't amount to much, anyways. Uh, that is the end of my turn. We're on to turn four for the Sallies. So Karen is popping over from yep. where he was, and he's gonna walk over. And take the DT, because I want you to have to choose which way you want to go. Okay. If you want to go for the Derrida, you can go for the Derrida. <laughs> if you want to go for the Sakaran, you can only go for the Sakaran. Okay, fair. And then he's going to take a minus two walking through that. Boop. And then I think Dreadnought's automatic. I don't think Dreadnought's automatically pass dangerous train checks either. Get over there. Only, uh... Whatever, let's find out. Leviathans do. Doesn't here. matter. Yeah. Uh, we are then moving over to here. You're maneuvering around my last cannons. I don't like that. Uh, and they take out the heavy team, eh? What a push with these guys. They are legends. Uh, I don't think the reaction's gonna do much for me here, so I'm just gonna hang out. I won't really be able to overwatch that. I can see like one guy maybe, so that's about it. Here's the DTs. 
There one. One. No, it's always one, dude. Always one. Pain, always pain one. in the piper. Oh, I can't even kill that as the guy can hey. watch. It's such opportunities to do and be this special. <laughs> Getting pinned, not ideal. Not ideal at all. Here, everything into the Galvor Brack. Uh, fine. I can't do anything about it. Uh, two shots. Oh, uh, I can do that. Yeah, cool. <laughs> nice. Nice. Good to good, good, good science. Karen Venator, everyone. It sucks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Really sucks. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Three, uh, uh, three, one wound. One, one, one wound. wound. Uh, armor. We're okay. <laughs> so into the support squad. All right, the, this is the, oh God. Was that triple ones? It was. That was the missiles firing yes, over here. it was. <laughs> uh, auto cannons. Uh, all hits. All hits, nice. And two, uh, two, two APs and Ooh, one nice. armor save. One Galvor, but I'll do armor save first. Let's get that out of the way. And then two field no pains. Uh, that's two damage. With everything. Twin heavy bolter hits with everything. Uh, force to wounds. And that's four and more. more. Four more saves. Ah, uh, that's a fail. Feel no pain. He's good. They're getting lit up by the bulkhead squad now from over there. Yeah, I, I think there was about eight that could see before. I'm going to check how many can see now. About eight of the bulkhead are going to be firing. 40 shots, and they all of my guys are in range to die. And line of sight. 40 shots. Here we go. Threes. Just threes and twos. Twos to wound. Excellent. It's a lot of saves. These are all three ups, and they can all die. Let's see if I can't pick all this up. This is quite a bit. Da, 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 the one-handed game and bam that's uh one two three four five six seven dead of the what seven oh they're all dead look at that exactly interesting. <clears throat> i have an interesting question here i could snap shoot three of these into here but then you haven't used your reaction you could shoot back right and your shoot is way better than my shoot so we're not going to shoot okay fair <laughs> yeah <laughs> absolutely um, and that is it um <laughs> flubbed flubbed did just fine. Did exactly what you and wanted to do. And then one charge? Oh, charge, yes. I can't overwatch. Uh, I could hold, though. I will uh, ooh, watch this. I'm going to fail my leadership and fall back. I'm going to hold steady. Go. They're good. Okay. <laughs> um, I think it's a six inch up. Oh, oh I, it, it might be five. five. It's a five inch elevation, so that guy would be literally in that pocket right there. So Boop. the other guys, how does this work? They, they can't fight? They're down here? Uh... We rolled exactly five, eh? That's unfortunate. Uh, because they're, they'd stay coherent, yeah. Uh, no, just put them in the back there. I, so, I don't know how to do this. Uh, you would you would be stuck down there, but I don't like the rules for elevation in this game. It's a little too punishing. 40k does it way better, yep. in my opinion. So, so you're saying me just, just chuck him up here? Yep. Happy or guys? or just, just to make the look better, they would, they would uh, I'd also allow them to fight them down there, whatever you prefer. Oh, it's all well, then it's the same difference. It's the, it's it's, this just looks yeah. better. Yeah. yeah. Just gonna go for it. Uh, fours, and then threes re-rolling. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, three, a thread. Boop, 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 boop. They're good. They're good. Let's punch Four. back. I got Five six. attacks back. Six attacks. Six charge. champion. I forgot about my tactical squad earlier, but that's okay. And hit him with your blast cannons. One wound. Ah, ah I win. win. <laughs> what? I do have a banner. Not that it matters. Uh, so yeah, leadership six. They they fail. You want to run me down? Are they six? Oh, the charge is dead. The is dead. I lost my one. I'll try to. You roll the one. I'll roll the one. Okay. The oh. Valiant. All right. That the was Valiant stand goes down. Did they, did they chase me down? Uh, no, they just stayed there. Just wipe them out. Yep, yep. That was uh, probably the best turn I've ever seen. Ooh, that, was a, that, was a, that was a bad turn. <laughs> that was spicy. Okay. I don't actually know what I would like to do. Uh, as we go into my turn four here, uh, there's not a whole lot left. The dust has settled. I got my Death Star thing left. Uh, but that's about. I got these guys, I guess. Still not die. It's a five plus, not a six plus. Doesn't matter. Oh, okay. To wound that Galvor back over there. Okay, so luck to these war bears. It's a good move. Uh, I, I want to go for the Sakaran, but that'll put me right in line inside of them, naturally, which is not great. We were just talking off camera about the support squad here who like just literally fumbled out, out of the gate. Onto gates. the table. It was yeah. like, you know, the hurdle jumps or they hit the yeah. first hurdle fall over and ruined the whole Olympics, dude. Like they just, they <laughs> screwed up. But they somehow are making it to the end. And I, it's like everyone else. It's like the, this is the, the tortoise and the hare well, kind of thing. You watched them now pick up that pirate class squad. Oh. And then they won't die. They won't die the rest of the game if they do. It'd be pretty funny. I am a little concerned about that pyro class squad if I'm still to be uh, a little honest. I wonder if I can last cannon them. I was supposed to put the dark favor somewhere. I'll put it on the Degal Borbach so they have extra movement. Uh, so that's their last point of dark favor. And then I have to pick something. It'd be the pyro class, I guess. Or, yeah, whatever. I'll say the pyro class. I don't really care at this point anymore. I got the bust I need. We're going to stay still with them. Our last cannon team is going to stay still. We are going to move the Galvor back Dark Brethren, though. And so they move eight now, or they move ten now? Uh, they one. move plus three. They move eight. They move 11. 
Move 11. Would you like to move all the way 11? They're all going to take DTs anyway. Yeah, they're all... 11 is to here. Uh, let's go up and around this way, 11, yeah. Uh, gonna my react. reaction, I'm going to pull you further back to gain as much distance as I can from Old Sakaran, who's going to try and start moving that way and getting out of out of, out of dodge. Was that the full 11? No, that, that's the 11. I'll yeah. take a couple back because the minus two for the damage stream. Oh, of course. Yeah. Apologies. That's okay. That's where they're going to end up. They're all going to take a DT because I'm yeah. going to trust the lava flow. You're going to trust in the lava? This no, one's I, a... I've been trusting in the lava. <laughs> it's probably hurt me more than you. That's where they end up moving after the negative two, and that's where the Derrideo ends up uh, running away to. That guy who's hurt is fine. And then I just have four other dangerous trains. Uh, they're all good. The character. Oh, he's not good. He takes... He's got involved. You can take involves. He's got an iron halo. He is not okay. And then we have the cha chaplain. He's also not okay, but he's no, got a... He didn't, he didn't go in. Well, oh, he didn't go in. You're right. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, he didn't go in. So one wound on that guy. We're going to go on to shooting. We're going to start... Shoot my Derek there. Just do it. <laughs> last cannons into the... Yeah, last cannons first. High row class. Because I can't shoot back. Would you like to evade? Uh, I've already got a five up, don't they? What would the evade do for me? It gives you a five up feel no pain, kind of. So I'd have a five up. Don't, I still, but I still get that. You still get that against the last cannons. Ah, that's not bad. So yeah. you have five hits. But you can't return fire over and here. I can't return fire there. Yeah. Which is what I kind of want to do, but... Mm -hmm. Tough call. Yeah. I'm probably dead if I don't, so I am going to evade. Evasion! So I hit on threes. Oh, I miss once, and I'm going to wound on twos. And you got five of cover saves from the building there, so that's three of them. Uh, oh, Ooh, make two! Five up shroud! He ah. does! He dodges the last cannon shot. Excellent. They are going to persist, but I'm a little free to fire over here now, so they're going to go ahead and shoot. Yep, uh, i got to make sure within 12. Still. Six shots at them, hoping for the best here. Threes. Oh! Oof. The best! The best is not Oof. available! Oof! One, one breach. One breach, which will be a five up. You're good. You're oh, absolutely the best. Man. No. After the absolutely the tides. kicking themselves in the shins, <laughs> they've decided to stonewall. Okay, okay. Uh, well, that's fine. Charge time. Oh, God. Let's charge uh, the Derradeo there. Would you like to overwatch? Obviously, yep. Yes. Um, yes. So here's the auto cannon. Uh, two's re rolling. Nice. And then two's again. Fives are good. That's cocked. And then re roll. So just one, one rend, one armor save. All right, so let's do the let's do the rend on the character four up. He's not okay, so he's gonna take. He's got one more left, and then the armor save is gonna go on the chaplain. We're good. Oh, I, or the I meant the Galvar back. The Galvar back. Yeah. yeah, I know what you mean. Uh, four shots, heavy bolter. Oh, all hits. Uh, it's one fail. Or all those these, fail. These all fail. And then that one. Oh, what's that one? That's a two. Yeah. Two. The fancy missiles. Twos. <laughs> that's a <laughs> that's second, a second time. time. What are the chances? Uh, that's very low. Why did I pay points for you? <laughs> that's what I was wondering. That's why I was so upset that's when that a, happened. That's amazing. I'm like, what is going on right now? A charge, minus two. Ooh. Oh, but we get plus. Plus two. So it's true yeah. distance. Yeah. And you is going to be a fail. Because if there's, if there's different move characteristics, you use the lowest, which is unfortunately seven, which has no modifiers to it at all. So charging through that negative two, they will, uh, so negative two, which means this is a three inch charge. Uh, we are going to search for So you move in seven. Yes. Negative two is a five and they made a five. No, no. Move seven is, um, uh, move seven adds no modifiers to the charge. So I only get a negative two. Oh, okay. So movement eight adds one, and then movement, that's all they would have had is boom. Oh, oh okay, yeah. I get you, mate. I yeah. get you. So I'm going to search forward just uh, a little bit. So that's Dangerous Train. Oh, my lord. That's He's okay. This guy's okay. That guy has to take Dangerous Train, though. Two DTs, yeah. This Sorry, guy also time. does, and then he's going to go into it, because he can't not go into it. Yikes. There we go. All right, so wounded guy, Praetor. Oh, oh, in in oh, bone? Oh, four up, four up. Oh, oh my oh, gosh, oh, so Lava oh, oh, almost took him, and Chaplin. He's okay. All right, so they're standing out in the open like dummies, but hey. That's okay. Not really, but it, we'll, we'll make our best of it. I just realized I just had also a bad. I just I didn't do any last game. You did game nothing. You didn't there. do any wounds in your turn. turn. Okay, battle round four. It was a bad battle it was a wash. round. Generally, it was all, no, all me around. too. Yeah, I, yeah, just, I yeah. got lost and ran away. Got yeah. cut down by last cannons. Overall horrible turn. Yeah. So uh, let, let, let turn five now. These pirate class are gonna push up on these. Uh, they're, they're taking the DTs. They're gonna go to the DTs. They're taking the DTs. We're Sally's. We're not afraid. We fear, we fear not the dangerous terrain. I am uh, just gonna hang out here. One DT. He's A-OK. -okay. Never heard of Excellent, it. excellent, excellent. Uh, and then that's pretty much it, because we don't want to risk these guys withdrawing. If this thing moves at all, they have a pretty high initiative in the unit, so they go directly away. Again, through the dangerous terrain, but uh, not ideal. Sikaren's gonna stay still. They're gonna stay still. We're right on the shooting. We have like next to nothing left. You're gonna start right over here. Dun, 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 dun. How many of my Galvorp, can you see like up to this guy? I can see three, yeah. Okay, can you see this guy? Uh, no. No, because only three can die. Only three can die, but okay. then the D flag could pop over. But That's this is, true. This is all 50 50 shots. But still winning on twos, though. That's the scary. Yes, because the plus one win. All 50 shots, threes and twos. Oh, Volkite. Oh, oh Volkite. You're so spicy. It's a very spicy gun. Oh, boy. That's pretty much average hits, I guess, <laughs> on the third miss. Twos to wound. 
Uh, ones will fail. Can only kill up to three of them, but the deflagrate can spill over that. Nine wounds in the unit. Three up save. So I'm gonna pull up the fails. 14 failed armor saves. I gotta make a lot of feel no pains here. And the feel no pains. Oh! I still probably failed nine? No, maybe not. I think I lived. Maybe not. I didn't. I'll die. Bless. Uh, one dead, two dead, one's fine. So Look at that. Six, six, six deflagrates for so another five, five saves. saves. So that one guy's got two wounds left. Three up armor. And uh, does he live? He doesn't. He deflagrate exactly. just killed him. <laughs> All dead. That'll be a morale check. Big boy who's got everything that can see and everything in range. Absolutely. Uh, threes. <laughs> Jeez, second turn in a row, he's done that too. He's got the heavy bolt. But at least so. he's got, yeah. <laughs> oh, Sakarin Venator. You don't belong here. It's a place for winners, Sakarin Venator. And you are not that today. <laughs> um, and these are fours. Yes. All right. Good. We got three ups here. I could do, oh, I gotta be careful. Uh, probably enough to, I gotta do four, I guess, at a time. So I fail three. three. <laughs> uh oh. And then it's gonna be three fail, no pains. And I still owe you a few after that. So that's gonna be one pass, but two fails. That means you die. And you're gonna have two wounds left. Two more saves on threes. Good. Oh, we're good. All right, so we're still losing another Gilmore back. Uh, Deridio time. It's Deridio's turn. We've got to go into Everything him. into him? Yep. Uh, right. We go with the uh, auto cannon. Re rolling. Nice. Works. And twos. Fives are good. Woo! Fives Woo! are very good. One armor, three rends. I'll do two up armor on the character, the chaplain. He's yep. good. Uh, and then we have three, three rends. Rolls. All right, well, let's do. Oh, gosh. Oh no, that's bad. Uh, uh, the Galvor back, he's gonna take him. Uh, so feel no pains. two feel no pains. He's dead. He's dead, and, and then one, more. one on the character. He's he takes one wound. Two. All right, so he dies. And they got one wound each. One wound each. Ooh, heavy the, bolter. And the uh, missile too. And the missile. Yeah. But you can take the heavy bolters on a two class on the Praetor. More yep. hits. Uh, three's the wound now, because all they're all, they're all gone. So three saves. Uh oh, uh oh, uh, three saves. Uh, these are all two, these are heavy bolters? Yeah. All two ups. Oh, that kills the chaplain. That's not a victory point. And then the Aeolus. Twos. And twos. And twos. This is the turn for the Derrida. The Derrida popping off. He's Got dead. Him. Boom. Oh so unlikely. Just cleared him out, dude. You're <laughs> out of here. Oh, they tried, though. They wreaked havoc. They wreaked they havoc. They went benign. Yeah, you'd have... My hope there on the failed charge was that you would kill them enough to the point where I'd have one Galvor back and the two characters to charge him yep. and then not kill him for the rest of the yes, game. Yes. And then save, save all, those all points, the points. Save all the points. All they right. got pasted over we here. We are big baller shooting the pirate class. Return fire! I'm freaking oath. It's right. It's right, <laughs> buddy. Uh, threes. Okay. Twos. One save. I got a cover. Oh, no. You're going to make it. I can feel it. No, that's a dead Take guy. Go back to the yellow dice. Threes. Ah, oh, that's good. And... Twos. Uh, one fail. Three breaching. Uh, it could be yeah, no so, set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh, and one, armor. one two up. It's made the armor safe. Then you got to overwatch him. <laughs> and we're going to go down in absolute gold star glory. Uh, champion so is there. So it was three. You're no there. saved yet. Those three. And yep. I have to do a morale check, actually. Morale check for... So he's the pinning check. Pinning check. On a nine. Yeah. Oh he's my pinned. god. <laughs> Second time, get it together, boys. Get it together. <laughs> I have to do a morale check. That's I lost twenty five percent. I forgot it earlier on them when I shot them on the producer, but they were pinned. So like that's kind of why we forgot, and it didn't really matter. Uh, we're good. You're, <laughs> You're good. Nice. I failed. Actually, I'm gonna go coup de gram. <laughs> Any, anything that's in your deployment zone is invincible. I found. <laughs> Um, <laughs> You're right, they haven't left the dude. <laughs> They're right on the line. Everything outside your deployment zone is just like chopped liver. Oh my gosh, dude. You got three victory points for killing that unit too. That's rough. Uh, so it's actually a pretty close game. I sh oof. All right, well, that's it. We're on to my turn five. I gotta deal with this guy. All right, so we're just gonna kill. All I can really do is kill this guy. Man, I, he's he's literally had it coming, I think. I'm just gonna move I these think. guys back here Pinned a little bit. twice. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, uh, we'll stay like that. There we go. We're shooting, he can't react. So we're just gonna shoot him with las cannons and we're gonna shoot him with a lava. Stand him up for me, just so he faces death. Uh, there like we the, go. Like the, the, the baller he is. All right, let's do, let's do las cannons. Vading, actually, yeah, no I'm shooting vading, the las cannons yeah. first. No evading. He's gonna shoot back into them and, and take one with him. You're gonna fail to kill him. Yeah, I believe. All, right. all ones. Twos. Fair. All right. <laughs> <laughs> he just gets skewered by four las cannons. He's, he pokes his head up, no, readies his he, pyroclass gun. Bleh. He's Stumbled into the into the uh, into the lava. It was like lava doesn't bother me. It does slow me though. Ah, last ah, cannon. My one fault. My one true weakness. <laughs> <laughs> They're powerless without their heads, dude. It's my turn. I got nothing. I killed him. That huzzah. 
Uh, and then your turn six, and then my turn six. My turn six. I uh, found out these guys go 16 inches. I need to find out where 36 is from them. To the back guy, 36 is here. Oh, you should be good. Should be very easily. You have a couple of dangerous terrain checks, or just one dangerous terrain check. 16 but. inches to here. I think I could probably do it without it. Oh, fair, yeah, true. Yeah. Take the DT, get all the, the heavy bolters. Ha. He's okay, excellent. And then this guy's doing the same, although he's pretty much all in range already. I'm gonna evade. <laughs> of course. 100%. Possibly move in order to see anything. I'm trying to hide this from the last cannons. Could you let me know if I've done that successfully? Oh, you're good, you're good. Yeah, is is that's your intent, yeah. My turn. Reposition there. Same, yeah. same difference. Same difference. Yeah, yeah. Um, and we're gonna start the shooting. You'll, this guy will shoot everything in there. Can I get a hit with the big gun? This oh, game? that's right, two shots. <laughs> it's a meme, Three dude. Three turns in a row. <laughs> Three in a row. <laughs> All right. Well, crap, I said I was gonna evade. I've used it, so. I was gonna evade on this guy, not this guy so much, but. Okay. I, it doesn't really matter what I mean, it's, it's kind of the same. It's this guy's the same got AP, yeah. AP1, this guy's got AP1. Yeah. Actually, it's probably better to do it on this guy if you want. He's got a lot. Yeah, I'll do it on him. He's got AP3 yeah. on the top and he's got rending. Yeah, do it on him. Yeah. Um, so these are just heavy bolters. Wow. Oh my gosh. This guy sucks. The Karen. Suck Karen. More Suck like it. Karen. Nice. Suck Karen. That's three wounds. Four wounds. Four wounds wounds with heavy bees. Uh, these are just three ups. We're doctor. Well, we take a wound. All right, that's going to be just the sergeant and the doctor. All right. All right, he's got to do two wounds. That's effectively it, last turn. Can you do it? This is where I'm evading. Rerolls. Oh, I, actually, I shouldn't have. There's no point in evading, I have a doctor. Oh, I evade against him to death. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then, oh my god. That's two failed wounds. And we have, oh, oh, AP. Oh, rent. AP. So we have five of cover, not bless, uh, and doctor or evade. Oh! Nice. Jealous. This is the scary one. All hit. All hits. Twos, AP three. Two, Two of them. These, oh, okay, I got cover. That's it. Yep. Cover and shrouding. Cover. That's a cock die. Ha -ha. Oh, cover and then the shroud. Oh! Nice. He saves them both. Gonna die. Uh, heavy, heavy bolter. bolter. Uh, all hits because BS5. Yeah, BS5. Uh, threes. Three, Three saves. More. Don't just die. Make all the things and die. From yeah, they're good. That's I it. do have to do a morale check though. That's it. Oh, so if they. Oh, that's the third. No, oh, they're good. They're good? They're eight. Eight should be good on the sergeant and the pop there. Uh, yeah, yeah. for sure. Now, if you folks want to watch another 30K battle report before you watch that post game or after, you can check out the links below and you can see my custodians taking on Damien and his death guard. Uh, so check out those links if you are either a paid YouTube member or you are a vault member. Now enjoy the post game or my other game. Whatever you want. Karen. <laughs> He's like, what well, the security did so well against the Galvar back though. <laughs> the main gun has not that, hit that's in fine. three turns. It is so funny. The heavy bolters are the sleeper. It could, it could yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so funny. All right, so my turn six is a, I just, I do nothing. I can't shoot anything. They have no range line of sight. Uh, they're gonna slink away. I don't, realistically, I think the sal before you even calculate the points, I think the Salamander will take the victory, but I'll, I'll call it Pyrrhic at best. <laughs> uh, I don't know about Empiric. Oh! Was, and literally, this failed charge was, I think, the game. That, oh, I, I didn't lose a lot. I lost a Praetor and I lost a uh, Chappy. A Chappy. And the Galverback, yeah. And you lost some. I'm trying to think of the value of our units, right? So that, I lost, that's a very valuable They killed warrior unit. one, two, three themselves. So they got three, four, three. That's true, yeah. Yeah. That's true. Okay, well, let's calculate points. I assume your target was infantry. It had to be, right? Yeah, because I had pretty much all yeah. infantry. I went with tanks because the rhinos were pretty easy kills and they were two points each. But I couldn't get, and there was a Sakaran, but he I, was hiding. So well, I considering him. he did nothing, even though I tried to use him, <laughs> I think hiding him was a very good choice. <laughs> I, I I think you're right, too. The, after you popped, you, 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 after you wrecked this, and then the guys popped out, got pinned, got uh, shaken, and then lost two to Dangerous Train, I'm like, oh, this is rough that whole side's pinned down and then he, he got a couple good hits early on on my praetor i'm like oh these are perfect shots to kill galvor back like no feel no pain no save just dead and then i'm like screw it praetor boom and i made that random oh, six did. Yeah. that was yeah. that was, it was big that was, was dumb big, that was kind of dumb but i'm happy i made that out so that was a uh, high that I mean, was definitely it's a little dumb if you fail right that's true it's <laughs> only dumb if you fail that was a little bit um, too much bravado so there how many infantry squads did i get you definitely got six points off of me as so i got six points there uh you killed all three of my Tactical squads. Yep. So that's three points. You killed the three characters I brought, that's six points. Uh, you killed the Galvor back, that's seven points. Uh, that might be I it. I think that's it. Yeah. Uh, Ashen Circle. Oh, both of them. Uh, I forgot them. Eight, nine. Damn, yeah. Wow. Oh, you crushed me. You crushed me. And uh, if, uh, do I get your Warlord? Yes. Yep, there's one there, and the side with the greatest number of surviving units. That's you? It's three to three, isn't it? I have. Oh, no, I've, got a, I've, got a, I've got a character, so it's yeah. three to four. You got, yeah, exactly. Three yeah. to four. Oh, so, yeah. Uh, so you got six. So I think it's about six to ten. 
I think you crushed me. Woo! You, in the end, that failed charge. It was the failed charge. But hey, to give, yeah. to, to give that, like, uh, Adam was a great opponent. He was like, let's just meet on the bridge. I'm, like, I'm not going to shoot Galvor back. I want to do an honor duel. I'm like, okay, sure. Heck yeah, let's do it. Which allowed me to let the Galvor back tear through your lines. I thought you were going to wipe me. And then one guy <laughs> lived, and I'm like, <laughs> I was. I, that's what I was hoping. I oh, thought no. <laughs> I was hoping. To, I thought it was gonna be like, oh I, hell yeah, fire drakes, just crush them, just embarrass them, uh, yes. and then stand on the open and die. Yeah, well, that's what I thought. I'm like, okay, cool. <laughs> they're gonna be like, come get me. We're gonna get you. And then we're like, pyroclast. <laughs> yeah, the pyroclast. Exactly. Grab, and then I'm like, oh dear, one. They're stubborn nine, and one lived. So I thought this is a horrible idea. <laughs> so like the, se the second he lived and he started, so I'm like, oh crap, they're stubborn too, and the one guy lived. That's perfect. I wasn't even thinking about that. Yeah, but yeah. once it came up to that, and like, then oh. you just started rolling through yeah. my army with them. And then and I started panicking. That, I'm like, oh, that's gonna be rough. That tear through that all. Terrifying. It is pretty nasty. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Galvar They like, is there anything they can't do? Unit like. Oh, they, uh, they're they, one of the upper. They're one of the yeah. upper. Like you, the the Dark Angel uh, Knights uh, nice Cynobium Snowden. are pretty yeah. bonkers. They're pretty yeah. bonkers too. They beat the. Bonkers! They beat the crap out of uh, Galvor back because they have instant death on the instant swords. Instant death on the things. Yeah, yeah. they're AP three instant the, death. Yeah, yeah, the Tyrannic great swords. Yeah, they're, yeah. Just, like, they're like perfect. Them. Yeah, perfect yeah. fight for Galvor Galvar back. Killing that's it. That's a fight I don't want to do. Like, <laughs> yeah. ever. Not once ever a thing. No. Uh, if you got jacked up with like three more initiative, you went in, hit them all on three. Yes, that would be you not could bad. Just yeah, pop yeah. them off. That would help. Um, <sighs> paperweight. Paperweight. It's damn. It's a, you know what? To give that thing credit, and, it's and a real good paperweight. Just to get this come off. Yes, that is the actual. That's the actual model that I had. For some reason, it had this thing on top. I'm not quite sure what this does because it's it's essentially it wasn't there. <laughs> oh yeah, so it funny. whiffed three turns in a row. Triple, triple, no, this guy whiffed three turns in a row. It's oh. whiffed two. <laughs> uh, two triple, triple one, triple one. Uh, this was tr uh, just six misses. Or six something. misses yeah. in a row. Six yeah. ones and twos. So between them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and, the, oh, and, yet, I, and yet, I still think they were both, they both uh, were very valuable. This now, game. the Volkite were excellent. The Volkite was superb. That was the, that's the whole shtick of this list, and I think it really is good. If I was to do this again, I'd actually take everything off the, the, the Delegatus. I, he's got a couple of pieces of war gear. Oh, I don't. I strip yeah. it all off. I'd strip yeah. it off. Yeah. He's, there's um, no point in having there's it. There's no I point. Guess, yeah. if he's just, but he should realistically, he should be a master of signal. But I need to be a Delegatus to take the right of war. Right. The list of pyroclasts be line. But I've got enough of these slots, I don't need it anyway. Correct. And okay. in a mission like this, where line doesn't matter, he could just be a, um, giving them better BS or something. Oh, Master of yeah, Signals. Master Signals. Volkai, like, albeit all the other heavy weapons got a lot better, Volkai technically got better because they got an extra shot. There's, yep. There were four shots before, but they they were like, they always gave me anxiety last issue because yes. they were just clear. I used See, to like run a lot of heavy infantry. Real, so I played against Steve and he had 20 man tactical marine squads and I was oh, like, just, oh my God, this is going to be good. And then he just had one Sarge that just went like oh, two ups four, the whole 14 game. two yeah, ups. Yeah. And I was like, well, they did nothing. See, yeah. that sounds like Steve to me. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's a Steve save role there. Absolutely. And so they, they win big, they win big, lose big. Like they could just pop off and just yeah. annihilate something or they could just get stonewalled by a single two up. The one thing I want to see, and I don't think it'd be that great of a show, is like the the, the weapon is designed to fight like Xenos and like lightly armored mm. enemies. So like fighting against like Imperial Auxiliary or, or, or like or... Mechanicum cults and militia and everything just absolutely tear just through waves. Them. Just yeah. just that unit off the table. That unit off the table. Only yeah. weird thing is it's a traitor. It's a traitor. Um, Warlord trait. Trade. Yeah, yeah. So, works for me because I like playing the traitors, but uh, might not be everyone's shtick. Yeah. So it increases the. It's plus one wound for the gun normally. Plus one, to, uh, yeah, plus one wound and AP. And AP and uh, against uh, armor penetrating vehicles. Yeah. So they count as strength seven against vehicles, and they are effectively strength seven in both. Actually, they're effectively strength seven in almost every regard. And just yeah. fifty shots at strength seven. I mean, just about any vehicle. Just the math not, on that is nuts. That's not yeah. AP fourteen. Yeah, is you're just gonna get it. It's just, like, you maybe, are maybe, gonna maybe, get it. Yeah. Maybe even a whole squadron of predators you could pop. It's pretty oh, ridiculous. Almost guaranteed you could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's actually nuts. It's 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 pretty brutal. It's about, oh gosh. Oh, if you could give him rending somehow too, that'd be comical. Uh, I don't know if he can. I don't think there is a way. Maybe there that is, would be know. ridiculous. That would be the that um, would be the cherry. This on guy's top. always my favorite. I don't, people, 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 <laughs> people crap on him, but the thing is that no one respects him, so he sticks around for like five turns. That's it. Okay, you you mentioned that off camera earlier. And I'm like, yeah. okay, I can respect that. The one thing he's got going for him, he's got the dreadnought keyword. Exactly right. <laughs> he's like, well, six wounds with a five up in Most people will be like, he doesn't do that much damage, so I shouldn't bother trying to kill him. Yeah, he's not going to punch me to death. And then he just right? lays medium output for six turns and he actually ends up being really valuable. It does amount to, those auto cannons will chip away at you. I prefer the plasma, personally. Yeah, I think the plasma is better. Play, yeah. play Trader Dark Angels. They're blasts. But no, so it's six shot, and then then you can have a strength eight blast. I see. A okay. strength eight rending four up blast yeah. against terminators, against veterans. It's really scary. Yeah. The first time I placed one on my mates had a had a veteran squad. I popped a rider, and then I was just like, "Is, is, is this strength eight? I'm like, eyes bugged out. I'm like, "It is." And I get Boom. a strength hit, and I picked up seven out of ten. And then my guy was like, 
Huh? <laughs> I <laughs> we will, just forgot I could do that. <laughs> I, I will. I will say the plasma arms are much better. Than, I think they're much better than the auto cannon arms. The auto cannon arms can punch pretty high yeah. on armor, I'm, but uh, I don't even know what the last cannons do though. I should look into last cannons. I, I, I forgot you could. You probably, they're probably good. They're last probably, cannons probably, are typically pretty good. Yeah. Probably thunder. Probably high yeah. strength. Yeah. Stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. I'd much rather. I, I I don't know what to take. What to put in instead of this guy in this one? Because um, I don't want to put in melee dreadnoughts because I think they're a bit. They're a bit OP. That's an easy answer. Yeah, they're a bit OP, because obviously that is what you should, what you would do with it. But in this list, I think I would trade this out for, I want a unit of vets in here. Um, I want like a, a problem solver unit. I want to, um, because funnily enough, there's just there's some missions where the, the pyroclast just ain't it. Yeah. Like, they just ain't it. So I want something that can go and kind of bridge a gap. And veterans are kind of a good catch-all. So maybe that's what I get instead. Absolutely, yeah. I do, I, I'd agree. Veterans are, I, I think veterans are damn good in well, general. They're, yeah. just, they're just like the, the perfect all-rounder unit. They they're correct, yeah. Everything. They're, they're, yeah. They did a really good job designing them for exactly that. They could yeah. provide good fire support. They could push up the line. They can hold positions really well. High wounds, good armor, you know, stuff like that. Yeah, I like veterans a lot. I should run veterans more. I plan on with my space wolves. In fact, these guys do. These guys should run veterans a little more too. But uh, I, yeah, we'll get there. I gotta stop running Galvor back. I gotta, I gotta figure out how to run lists without Galvor. They're great they're and great. they're amazing, but um, there's ways to play without them. How'd you like the Mortat? I love the Moritat and the Ashen Circle. The, so the Ashen Circle have probably, they're probably the <coughs> the best, the re one of the reasons I say the Pirate class are bad is because flamers are bad. And half of what you're paying for with them is kind of the flamer yeah. portion of their gun. Which they never get to use, people just like, oh, flamer? Yeah, back up. Back up. Ashen Circle um, move 12. And they move 12 and then they've got a six inch torrent. Yeah. So there's no escape the flamer yeah. template. It's going to yep. get you. Yeah. Um, and then they're actually a good AP3 rending yep. in combat. They're actually yep. good in combat. They, 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 sh they absolutely destroy 20 man squads. Like a five man squad of Ashen Circle will shred a 20 man yeah. tactical squad. How many points are they for five? One. 50, that's 140. A bit, that's a bit. That's they're pretty, they're pretty expensive. Yeah. They, 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 for one wound. The nice thing is they have heavy armor too, so they get to reroll. Oh, that's actually really nice. Yeah, they got heavy really armor good. too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, I love, and I, I personally, I think word bearers have the best bespoke units. Yeah, well, I, 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 they have the most. They, they, they have some of the most, I think. And they, they yeah. look good. They yeah. still look good. Dash like, circle unlike looks so good. like um, Red Butchers and like some, <laughs> the, some of the other relatively new ones, the word bearer units still look fantastic. Yeah, they haven't they, aged they, that much. They've, they've, they've aged very well. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The, uh, I, I'm, I, Love that more attack. I, I think he's a little like he could be a little much, but I think he's quite good. I have to figure out how chain fire works more for its proper. Like not that I didn't do it improperly here, but like you can't react with it, you can't charge with it. So you have to like do it properly, yeah, right? You yeah. can't overwatch with it. Can't so overwatch with yeah. it either. Yeah, that's it's good. really a, yeah. It's like Fury of the Legion essentially. Exactly. You, like, you can do that and nothing else. Yeah. It's still pretty good that like, no matter what, there's probably going to be 12 shots because the big thing is he never gets hot. So it's like 12 right. breaching shots. Well, yeah. he just killed this runner, right? He's yeah, like, he just, uh, uh, do, do, dead, boo, boo, dead, yeah, dead round. It's yeah. pretty good. It, it does, they do lose the strength on their uh, plasma, so it goes to strength six, but they lose gets hot and they get pinning. It's fine. Yeah, it's, it's pretty fine. good. I think it's pretty it's good. The fear pinning as well. The fear pinning, yeah. That's a 25 really, point upgrade, really but nice. it's still pretty nice. Yeah. 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 I like well, how many times I get pinned this game? Um, pinned, pinned, pinned. I got pinned three times. Yeah. Straight up. Was, uh, pinning was big. Pinning was big, pretty big, big yeah. Well, I, I didn't get a chance to show up the big Warfire team. Like, that's a squad of 10 Warfire Plasmas. Yeah. That could be pretty nasty when they get out there. But you, you dealt with him. Uh, I, I, I saw what I saw what he was like, oh, wow, he can only get out in the lava, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Boom. Yeah. Out in the lava, a couple of them died. Yeah. They don't quite make it. Yeah, that was, that was a sad they story. They didn't leave you a deployment zone, but they ended up killing a they, bunch of stuff. At some, enough. Somehow, in the end, they survived <laughs> until the very end. I don't understand the, how that's Everything is. going against them from turn one onwards, and they're like, oh, we only need to move about eight inches anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> dead squad, dead squad. Yeah, they that was really it. Good. They did. They did good for me. I'm pretty, pretty, pretty proud of them. I'd run them again. They're damn expensive though. It's 15 points per guy for that plasma gun. Yikes. There's 10 of them, so 150. That's wow. that's a lot. Yeah. I gotta put artificer armor in there too. A couple things I would do different with the list, I think, but not not nothing too crazy. Last cans are good. Always good. You can't can't leave home yeah. without them. Uh, I typically want to run 10, but 10 is like one of those like ah. <laughs> so the only big thing I was considering is whether whether this was the right spot to put these because I could have put them there. Yes. But then they could get to Galvor backed, they could get Laz Cannon, but then they can shoot back on Laz Cannons. I think I win that if you shoot me first. Yes. Because um, you can kill five of mine, I definitely kill all of you. Uh, you you'd kill all five um, of mine. The other, yeah. other place was to be here. Um, or I don't know how we would feel about that, but that would that would look cool. That would have been cinematically cool, like stay, holding the top of the. That would have been cool. But, um, looking, yeah. They would probably gotten deaded at some point. <laughs> it's true. They would have. Uh, they're in bolter range well, at that I, point I, too, I right? I at your yeah. army. I was like, well, I'm pretty sure he's coming to me is more than I'm coming to him. That's typically how I play. And, that, yeah. that's, and that's that was why they went back. Yeah, it makes sense. That's a good spot for them. It does sacrifice the line side over there, but yeah. it kept them generally safe. The yeah, because it's yeah. actually right. Because if your Galfer back can't can win here, they were dead. And so you, you did get a whole. You got two more units and a whole another turn out of them. Well, it would have been another one if you. Just <laughs> Rolled better than a five, right? My h
like, he was going to jump up here. She yep, was going to yep, jump yep, right yep, there yep. and shoot him across. Oh, that would have been sick. That would have been cool. Like, bang, bang, bang. Cool. And like, he could have killed quite a bit of them, too, mm -hmm. depending on how well the rolls go naturally. Uh, anyways, folks, that is it for this Horus Heresy game. Thank you, Adam, for being a good sport and like jumping in on the challenge in the middle there. I always appreciate oh, that man. kind of conduct. Come at me, bro. Yeah. And then, I got a cool, I got a cool uh, reaction on one of these. That's fair. And there was yeah. a bridge in the middle on a lava table. <laughs> got to throw it down. You got to fight on the Salamanders. bridge. Salamanders. You got to do what you got to <laughs> do. All right, folks, we'll catch you next time for some more wargaming. Happy wargaming as usual. Toodaloo, everybody.